Oh, howdy. Corbs here with another George Hughes RP stream <coughs> on the Diablo RP server. It's been, I think it's been like a week. So I was away in Sydney and I have, I've had some IRL stuff uh, this week going on. So <coughs> I think it's about, been about a week. So I've knocked over um, a bunch of stuff this week. So um, probably get back into doing, you know, a bit of George Hughes here and there. Maybe, probably not like like I did recently where it was like like a week straight. Like probably just more like every second or third night. Whatever, but hello, Gazozo. How you going? Gazozo. Gazozo. <laughs> um, I don't have much money on me. Oh, no. Oh, I don't have much money on me. I was hoping to, um... I was hoping I'd have enough money to, um... Go to the barber <laughs> and and give Hughes like a really big beard and hair as if he hasn't um, shaved over the last week while he's been up in Boston because yeah, he went up. We, we've just we've just pretended that he's gone up north for a bit over the last week by boat to like Boston or whatever. Yo, Wes, how you doing? How you been? Um, damn. I did not think about that. Well, I, yeah, I didn't know. <clears throat> I didn't know how long I would be gone for. I wish I had a little bit more money. Um, or I can... <coughs> if I... <coughs> ah, excuse me. If I race over to Blackwater, I can get some money out and I can quickly go do that before I run into anyone. That's annoying. I Yeah, I did not think about how much money I had in my pockets. And how much, um, and how much haircuts and that cost? Because to like add a add a beard and long hair, that'll be like what, 10, 20 bucks? And I've got, I've got, I don't even have two dollars on me. So hopefully we can get to the Blackwater Bank and Barber without running into anyone we know. Pray for me, chat. Pray for, pray for George. Pray for George. I'm all right, Wes. I am all right. I had to, <clears throat> I had to take the day off work today because I've just a bit of a, there's a bit of a, a tummy bug or something going around. My boss has had it, and because he's then been doing stuff in my studio at work, I think I've gotten it. And so today I was like, oh look, boss, if I could take a half day, um, and if you need me to come in the afternoon or something, let me know. But then it turned out I could just take the whole day, which was really nice of him. But I think I think I've got plenty of sick leave built up, so that that'll be all right. But apart from that, I've just been um just seeing to some IRL stuff, um, and I just wanted to, to focus on that um, without being distracted by Red Dead RP. So yeah, I've been back for a, a few days from Sydney, but I was like, nah, I'll I'll wait until I knock over these things before I. Just, you know, once I get into doing the Red Dead at night, that's that's my whole night gone, pretty much. So, I wanted to be sure. Very, very important stuff. So, the ride to Blackwater. How long does that take? Five minutes? Yo, Zuka! Yeah, yeah, I remember. Yeah, the old armor three days. <laughs> yeah, I've been doing um, I've been doing Red M since like uh, August last year. But no, dude, I remember you back in the because yeah, that's when I when I first started streaming back in like 2020. Yeah, so much armor three at the time. So much armor three. Like I think it was like an op, an op like every Friday night and Saturdays and that. Still some good times there. But how you been? Yeah, that takes me back to when I when I first started streaming. There was a lot of um, there was a lot of Armor Three. Uh, I also did a lot of Holdfast 
line battles, which is, it's kind of like, it's that hold fast game, the multiplayer, but it's like, it's RP, uh, it's like Red Dead RP in a sense, and also it's kind of like um, Armor 3 Ops where, you know, you don't all just run around willy-nilly, you actually all uh, get in line and you fire when you're told to, like, to make it legit, so, yeah, it, it's, this is, it's not, I, yeah, I imagine it's not much of a surprise to see me doing Red M after doing Hold Fast and Armor 3. Oh, dude. Yeah, there was some, there was some truly, um, some truly funny times with the Armor 3 Ops. And, like, I, I loved the moments when everyone was able to be serious. And because with the Armor 3 Ops, there's a level of RP with that as well. To just make it feel authentic and just add to the, just add to the, the overall vibe. Um... Um, but yeah, there was some like truly, oh, some of the meme moments were amazing, and you know, like some of the serious moments. And, and sometimes I do miss doing Armor 3 Ops. Um, I don't miss setting up for it though. <laughs> all the, all the mods and like team speak and that. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. But there were some good times. There were some bad times. But there were some good times. I miss, I'm, I miss doing the hold fast line battles as well. That was, the people I played with were really cool. Uh, in, the Imperial Frontier Force, IFF. Uh, they were a really good bunch of dudes. I just, I just had too many things going on. I couldn't commit to doing everything. God, that takes me back. That takes me back. And what now, and then, so this is four years later. Been streaming for four years. My God. Lots of ups and downs, like everything else in life. Yo, Tom Loy, how you doing, mate? Welcome home. Mate, I'm trying to get to the barber and the bank without anyone finding me because I want to give George a really big beard and hairdo as if he hasn't shaved while he's been gone. I don't have... I don't even have $2 on me to do it in St. Denis. So I'm trying to get back to Blackwater and hope I don't come, come across anyone. Like, damn it. I sh shouldn't have bought all that food and that when I left. But what can you do? You still in Milsim Zoo? Just a better group, still A3. Also play And you do 5M! Like I I'd love to give 5M a go, but I think I will wait for 6M. I think. I just I feel like I'll be crossing the streams too much in my head if I go to 5M and then I'm doing more red M and then GTA 6 comes out. I think I'll just wear myself out. So I'm gonna I'm gonna wait for 6M whenever that's ready. I think to try it. I don't know if I'll like it, but I'd like to at least try it. Hundred and twenty mod download, my god. Oh, oh man, Zuga, that oh this is all taking me back. It's, it's taking me back, man. My god. It feels it, it feel like it feels so long ago. It feels like like, four, I guess four years. Yeah, four years is quite considerable. Like, that's nearly half a decade. But it, it makes me... I always feel like I'm thinking... It makes me feel like I'm thinking back, like, ten years or something. Like, oh, yes. I remember. Back in... Back in my day. <laughs> Too many folks about... That's a very quick pin. Val Bakery, yum. Very quick and to the point. Very, very, very efficient and mi minimalistic advertising. Well, I'm glad to hear you're still doing the the mill sim and everything, Zuka. That's cool. I do, I do miss it. But yeah, it's, primarily for me, it's been Red M since, um, since about August last year. I still do the odd <clears throat> other game, or, or you know, speed run every now and again, but it has primarily been this for, for that time. Hey, Julian, Mr. Humdinger, hello, mate. Coming in with, coming in with the raid. Hey, go on, mate. <coughs> Doctor Chocula. 
<laughs> what is that sign? How's everybody doing? Julian, what were you what were you playing tonight, mate? Here to respectfully whip it out. <laughs> you must whip it! <laughs> Thank you, mate! I've just I've just jumped I've just started. So nothing's really um nothing's really happened yet. I'm trying to get to a bank and a barber without anyone seeing me, so I can get out some money and then go get a bigger beard and hair. Because I haven't been on for like a week, so I think it would be funny if it's like my character hasn't shaved in like a week and he's got like this massive beard. Like it just gets out of control really fast. So I'm hoping I can get there without anyone seeing me. I'm fingers crossed. We might have to splinter cell our way into town. <laughs> Today you played Bloodborne and yet. Wait, is yelled. Like, did you yell or is yelled a game? Is yell the game? <laughs> but Bloodborne, mate, I, I suck at those Souls like games. How how are you finding it? Because I, I just can't do them. I never I could never finish Dark Souls 1. I had a friend that was helping me with like, you know, the way they can like come in as ghosts or whatever. For co-op for the boss fights, but I dude, I suck. <clears throat> oh, it's like yelling as in as in act like vocally yelling. Okay, I thought I thought you were gonna say that you yell like yelled with an exclamation mark is like a game, and I was like Thinking, what what would that game be about? Like, yeah, the, the game uses your microphone, and the louder you yell, the more damage you do with your Dragonborn Skyrim shouts. You gotta play yell. You gotta play it. <laughs> well, the vetoes. Ah, oh, Red Dead One and Red Dead Two are amazing. Uh, this, I'm, pl I'm currently playing the um, on a roleplay server. So this is my character, George Hughes. Um, he's... It's a time. <laughs> I don't even know how to describe it anymore. Yo, Cam! Thank you for the seven in a row! That's a whole... That's a whole bloody week! That's a whole bloody week of streams, mate! Thank you. I appreciate all the support. For silly old... Silly old me. I, too, like to have apple lemon smoothies in a dark alleyway. Mmm. That's my favorite pastime on a Friday night. Bank, bank, bank. All right, we've made it to the bank. With anyone finding us. Also, Mrs. Phenom. Coming in with the resub. 40 month streak. My goodness gracious. Goodness gracious. Thank you very much. That's insane. That's insane. <clears throat> Alright, withdrawn $50. That should be enough to go get a bigger beard and hair. <coughs> oh, so you're forcing yourself through all the Souls like games. Well, once you get through all of them, like it'll just become you'll be like one with one with it. You'll be one with the with the with the roll. I just I wish I had the patience for it. My hat goes off to those that are, enjoy those games and are good at it, but I, I suck. My my reaction time, my reaction speed with those sorts of games and patience is not so good. It's it's not good. Um, it's embarrassing to say the least. But you gotta go to bed. No worries, mate. Well, again, thank you for the raid. Welcome in raiders. Hope you all had a great time with Julian. If you like Red Dead. And or roleplay, and or funny Australians with that could do a bunch of voices. I hope you enjoy your time. But right. do what you got to do. Make sure you live your life how you want, sir. If you want to go to the barber at midnight and and grow a beard, then you should do that. You should do that. Beard, beard, beard. Beard. I'd like a beard, please. Uh, probably that. Well, then. Probably the Arcadian, I think. No. That's all we've got. No. No, yeah, we want, we want this one. We want this one. Oh, it's only $2.50. 
And here. <laughs> One beard, please. Look, coming right up. Coming right up, sir. Uh, and where's like the where's the the ridiculous hair? That's one. That's one back in a ponytail, I think. Oh yeah, because it literally says long ponytail. Thanks for the lurk, mate. Thanks for the lurk, mate. Uh, I've tied. I think we want that one. I think this is the one we want. Alright, so let's just pretend. Let's pretend that this is how George Hughes came off the boat in St. Denis. Canonically, canonically, that's what's hap that's what happened. Um That's what's happened. Alright. Bearded man. So we've been gone a week, and I think Cynthia Wheeler said she would send a telegram uh, every day about stuff going on. So we better go check. We better go check our mail. <clears throat> we might. We might have a couple of telegrams to read. I think that might be trouble. Let's take a look. <laughs> Day one without Hughes. Day two of no George Hughes. Day three of no George Hughes update. <laughs> Alright, let's, let's have a look. Dear Mr. Hughes, as promised... I thought I'd summarize the day, and boy, it was a trial by fire. First, I was mauled by a grizzly bear. I got quite hurt and am definitely left with some scars. Not sure I'm going to forget that. But unfortunately, try as I might to slow down, I had to assist the other medics and treated 10 patients back to back in St. Denis, ranging from choked on a chicken bone to multiple, multiple gunshot wounds. Finally, I'm headed to Strawberry with William to rest for the night in the clinic and just read some books and drink some wine. It's been a long day. Hope Boston is treating you well. Cynthia Wheeler. Mauled by a bear, that sucks. Happens to the best of us. Day two. Well, I thought I, I thought I sent this telegram already, but now after sobering up, I realize I initially sent it to the wrong person. Either way, your presence in the country is certainly missed today. Work-wise, it was reasonably relaxed, but I have some news. William Seliger... Seliger? Seliger? I don't know if I've ever heard that. Asked to court me. Oh my. Effectively declaring his intentions toward me. I said no, you know me, eternally in search of friendship above all else. Things are difficult, and my missent message has likely only made it more difficult. Now he knows I've told you. Your friend, Cynthia Wheeler. <laughs> <laughs> That's awkward. Day three. Dear Mr. Hughes, not a busy day today, but I did spend a lot of time in Armadilla, and I've decided to move my residence to New Austin from Valentine. I did accidentally get shot in the neck with an arrow, but it didn't get me too deep. So I'm in good spirits. Your friend, Cynthia Wheeler. <laughs> Got shot in the, in the neck with an arrow today, but I'm doing all right. Calder, question mark. George, despite your best peace talks, I just witnessed Calder beat a duck to a bloody pulp in the middle of Blackwater, stating that Dottie was being too loud, which she was. And then he threatened to beat me too for putting my hands up and trying to go between them. Just thought I should write you. I'm anxious now. And would rather write whilst it's fresh in my mind. <sighs> so Caldo's just completely gone back on the agreement we made. That big meeting we had under the tree up in the plains. Having him like less than less than a week. Less than a week he's already beaten a doctor up and threatened to beat up another one. Thanks, <laughs> Vitos. I've watched a lot of movies in that. That is that is very disappointing to read. 
That is very disappointing. It hasn't even been a week, and he's gone back on the agreement. That's... That's just... That's despicable. That is despicable. That's just not on. I have returned. Miss Wheeler. Thank you for keeping me updated. I am incredibly concerned about the ordeals you've had to endure in my absence. <clears throat> Visiting my home my, my old home up in Boston and catching up on a few things has really refreshed my outlook on a few things. I think I may need to be making some serious changes So that, so that I can carve out my own little piece of peace and quiet in this crazy world. I can't imagine you'll be able to find me on the usual West Law Troll rats. But I'll be around. George Hughes. So for anyone if anyone's wondering about more context, is that um yeah, because I had to go away for a, a bunch of days. I had to fly to Sydney and back recently. I um I petered out where that my character here, George, got on a boat in Saint Denis and went up north to the Boston area, where um where he grew up and you know he did a bunch of stuff, a lot of good stuff, a lot of bad stuff. He's gone up there, so I'm implying that he may have gone up there and he's maybe visited the grave of his uh, deceased wife and child. Maybe gone and visited the precinct of the uh, law department he was trained at. A um, whole bunch of stuff like that, which is sort of... Uh, it has influenced his... Maybe maybe having a new outlook on things. Which also uh, relates to um, just how I've felt over the last week or two with a lot of real life things I've ne been needing to do which also involves my constant uh, struggle with things like depression anxiety and god knows what else so um, I've had to really look at look at it as a character and also as a player because um, video games should be an escape from things you are having trouble with in real life and there's just some things with playing a lore character that just every now and again since I've been playing since August that come up where it's just it's just it's not it's not really my first choice of something to experience in a video game um it's just it's getting to a point where it's like I don't know if that's really my uh I don't know if that's my jam anymore maybe I need a bit of a take a step back for a bit and reassess especially with real life stuff going on so let's uh let's sit down here and i will write up in the law discord and we sit down again yo recklessness it was fine just it was all right it was all right how are you going uh we go to the um Leadership announcement, I think. Sheriff's office. Yeah. Um, 
<coughs> to the West Law Department. My time, my time up, uh, or oh, hopefully, hopefully all has been well down this way. My time away up north in Boston, revisiting my old um, home. Um, family and uh, and fellow law trainees um, has has uh, rejuvenated or has um, I don't know um, has given me me a fresh look on life. So, so while I take the time to explore, um, explore a lot of things, I am leaving this note to you as my intention, uh, to... Um, my intention to take a leave, uh, an, an extended leave of absence. All the best and good luck. George Hughes. Uh... Uh, better out as well. I currently have no set date on when I will return. But I hope it goes without saying that in my travels, if I learn of anything of value to the department, I will let you know at the earliest convenience. All the best and good luck, George Hughes. That'll do. There we go. Yo, twerk. It certainly is not. It certainly is not easy. It is certainly not easy. Especially when you're trying to deal with a bunch of stuff in real life as well. It is, um... It can be really trying. I don't think a lot of criminals understand just how stressful and... Um... And just, it, just how hectic it can be. Like, you're dealing with paperwork and writing to things and dealing with things and it's just go 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 and a lot of it's like there's no there's no like it's you know it's not expected to win all the time but it's like but it's like it can be it's, it can be extremely exhausting it can be extremely exhausting um like it's it's really tough it is really tough um i don't know i don't know I appreciate that twerk. Hope you've been enjoying it, recklessness. <laughs> Tom, have you considered losing all your memories when you wash up on a remote island and serve a drug lord slash dictator for a few months? That did cross my mind, and I was like, no, we can't do that again. That's that's people will see that coming. <laughs> We've already done that. <laughs> Time to become a crim. Oh god, no, I don't think I don't think George could could morally do that. Right, Cam. It's um, it's a, it's a time. Um, uh, and then one of these. So the, two of these are for the evidence locker, but one was given to me by Sheriff Bowman. 
So I'll clear out my locker. Just in case. I get back to the bank. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> You've seen a lot, have you, Twerk? It, yeah, it's um. Some nights, depending on where you are, like you could just you you'll go through a lot. Like some towns, it will just be back to back shenanigans. Bueno, and it'd be like, bro, I can't keep up. Can't keep up. Yo, MT converted a prime sub to a tier one sub. Thank you. That's very kind of you. Thank you, MT. Hope you're well. Thank you very much. Um. Uh, so, how do I get storage again? Buy storage. Three hundred dollars. Fucking hell. Three hundred dollars for some storage. Huh? No, I I feel that MT. I de I have also been having a time. <laughs> Slots amount. What? I don't understand. What? So it's... What? So you buy storage. The price... So, okay, storage. Says price is $300. Right? Uh-huh. Slots amount. And then that's what adding... Is that adding another $4 per slot? Storage unit have been bought for $340. Okay. Go to the door to act enter the vault and access storage. Okay, well, why is it an option there, then? Storage management. What? This door? Here? Okay. So, you what? You got to pay the $300 to get storage, and then you got to pay, what, $10 or something? Per... Slot or something? I don't understand. I I don't I don't know. I'm confused. Four dollars per slot. Right. Me confused. I'm not a smart man. I'm going to need more. Rubsy, is it? Or Rubsy? Thank you for the follow. Howdy, partner. I need slots just to put on my worms. Yo, Clavicle deserve to be robbed for charging $300 for 10 slots of storage. Yeah, it's like, holy crap. Again, it's like, I, I like to play video games to escape from, from reality. <laughs> How do I get out? And then I'm, and then I'm guessing it's just, it's, it's, um, it's storage just for... 
like just for this bank. Unreal, man. Yikes. I just need some more to store some stuff. Storage management. I just need to store more worms, bro. How do I go back in now? Or does that, like, activate it? Yes, it does. Now I can store my wormies. Get in there. Get the... Get the fuck in there. I hate fishing. <laughs> um, I should probably... Might do some hunting. Might do some hunting soon. Why is it so foggy there? There's no windows, MT. There's no windows. Everyone comes in, has a cigar while they're doing it. And then you can't, um... You can't see. <laughs> There's no ventilation. It's It's ridiculous. <laughs> Yo, Snowman Hunter. Um, yeah, might do some... Might do some hunting, I suppose. Or I'll probably send a telegram... To the... I might... I might gain, um... Um, I might seek out employment with the trains or something. Just as something different to do for a while. Um... Uh, let's go, let's go get changed. And then let's go, I believe I have the Jones Brothers telegram written down somewhere. So let's do that. So I might scrap the Albert Groves character altogether. And might seek out doing, um... Trains as George for a while. Just as something different. Just to try things out. See if I enjoy that more. Well, that I, I thought it would be funny, MT, that um, you know, George is George has has been gone like a week and it's like he hasn't shaved or anything, like for like a week, and this is how he looks. Like, it's just so ridiculous. It's like weeds! Just spring it out like weeds. The clothing store. I can't remember which one leads around to the clothing store, so we'll just go around. That is a big horse. The fucking war horse, man. We'll get George into something a bit more casual. Might do some delivery jobs. A unicorn! This reminds me of, um... A dude wears my car. Hey, look! A unicorn! A unicorn! Oh, it was just a regular horse. It's so dumb. It's so dumb. That damn movie. Dude. What does mine say? Sweet! What does mine say? Dude, what does mine say? It's so, such a silly movie. Yo, Feezy. Thank you for the resub, mate. 11 month streak. My goodness. Goodness gracious. Thank you, mate. What's all this then? Uh, George is taking an extended leave of absence from the Law Department. For in character and out of character reasons. He hasn't resigned, he's just expressed that he's taken a 
A long ass leave of absence, and well, whatever comes of that happens. So. Blackwater is surprisingly quiet. There's no one. These fucking boxes, dude. These fucking boxes. Do 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 do. Hmm, pocket chicken. Nom nom nom. Yeah, and I and I and I I told you, I told you what I've um, um, what I had on this week. So I've got that as well. So I need to. That needs to be my focus at the moment. Um. Uh, yo, vanish. Hey, doing man. Um. Now, have I written down... Um, where did I write down? Where did I write down the Jones Brothers telegram? Um... Uh... Uh, where did I write that? It's not in my phone notes. Oh God. Oh god, I don't know. It's not in my phone notes, and I haven't done it in the game. And it's not in my Discord notes. Oh no. Oh no. What? What's happened, Vanish? Oh, you tried GTA RP? Oh, yeah. It, I was not... I was not looking forward to doing, um, keyboard and mouse, but I've gotten you- you get used to it. But yeah, I, I feel you, man. It's like, I want to play with control over, please. Are the Jones- are the Jones brothers the ones that had the big... That had the big stupid dude that sang? Huh? Huh? I want to tell him no long arms in town, but... Not my fucking problem right now. <laughs> From the bank robbery. What do you want? Who the fuck are you? Now I know, well, yeah, it looks okay. Maybe I don't have the Jones brothers, um, what is that? Gold pan. I was like, it's the Triforce. Well, I know they're, I know they're based in Rhodes. So we might have to go ask him. Stole the prison boat. I... I don't remember. I do not remember. I should... I thought I... I thought I had... I thought I had their, um... Oh, you shot it and sank. Nah, no, that was um, that was no, that was that wasn't a Jones brother. That was a uh, yeah, another character from another pair of brothers. Oh, jeez, watch out! I can't remember. Yeah, no, not Jones brothers. Um, the um, something. I do not recall. Yeah, one with one with a silly name. 
Um, uh, I don't think this has. I don't know. I don't think this has any key binds. I don't think. Um, it's just a lot of, um, you got to do a lot of like T slash this and that. Like a lot of, com you got to remember a lot of commands. But I don't think there's any like key binds. Yeah, I'm just, I just use the mouse and keyboard as normal. Well, I'll go to Rhodes. And I'll see if I can ask around for, um... The Jones Brothers telegram. Post ID. I suppose that will be my first point of business. No worries, Cam. Good luck with your raid. Godspeed. No, I um, I I've never tried GTA RP. This was the this was my first time doing anything like this, this here in Red Dead because a bunch of friends were doing it. Um, I've been curious to try it, um, but I just I've never done it. And I at this point I think if I ever do GTA RP, I will wait until um, it's with the next GTA. I think. I reckon. I reckon any RP I do net between now and when it come when 6M happens on computer, I think I'll just do red M. While it's while it's a thing. Cause it comes out what well, it comes out on console next year. And then predictions are, well, predictions is that uh, it will be out on PC within a year of that. So that'll fly by. <laughs> and I don't need another time sink at the moment because I'm trying to find other things to be doing. And there's a whole bunch of other games I want to play. So like, I do not need, I do not need another commitment like this. Bit of bit of drama eight work. Oh. That sucks. Like a bit of drama's good, but if it's like unnecessary and it's bullshit and that, it's like, can people just not suck? I think it's just cause the the console version will be easier to um will be easier to uh optimize. And that because it's like the hardware you've got for the latest Xbox and PlayStation and that, that's set in stone while for PC they have to they have to factor in that uh, the average player will have a variety of different CPUs graphics cards RAM and all that so they're trying to I think their goal is to try and find like something that will adequately suit a variety of uh, builds, which just takes a lot more time. They need a lot more. They need more. They need more data. They need more data. Sorry to hear that twerk. Like I'll, I'll, with with George and a bunch of my other characters. Like I'll, I, I don't, I don't know, I don't know if you describe what I do with them as carrying on, but I try to, I try to keep it grounded as best I can. But then there's also a lot of like comedy thrown in. But like I really try and focus on the story that's for everyone involved and just trying to provide cool or interesting or funny. 
additions to whatever's going on. Um, I just try and really do that. I, I definitely know that, like, FOMO will... FOMO will be so fucking real when GTA 6 comes out. So, I will no doubt get it on uh, Xbox Series X. Unless I... Unless I have a ps5 but i seriously doubt it i will i will definitely get it on xbox series x just to at the very least play through the story mode and really enjoy that maybe a little bit of online multiplayer and all that just to you know because i don't want to i don't want to be avoiding the internet for a year with spoilers so i'll get it for that um and then i will inevitably get it again on pc to try rp and that so um Yo, Saint. Thank you for the lurk. Hope you've been well. Oh, I... Well, I, I have faith in Rockstar. Um, I, I have a lot of faith in Rockstar. They put in a lot of work. They... They put in a lot of polish. Who the... F <laughs> Who the fuck are you? State your Hi. name and intentions. Hello. Todd? Yeah. Oh, for f How long have you been following me? Uh, for Splatnik. Oh, for fuck. <laughs> I didn't even know you were there. Hello. How you been, buddy? I'm alright, how are you? Oh, I've been better. I get back and... I got a whole range of telegrams from Miss Wheeler saying that Cal Dern couldn't even last a week till he started beating up doctors. Wait, what? I, I got a telegram from Miss Wheeler that he he beat to a bloody pulp a doctor, I think in the middle of a town, and then he threatened to beat oh, up yeah, another one just because of Miss Dottie. What did Miss Dottie do? God, I don't know, shoot a bison? I don't know, but they couldn't even last a week and just... You know, I, I had to deal with some things up north, and it's just, it's it's just sort of fixed, refixed my perspective, Todd. Um, I'm, I don't know if you saw my note I left in the office, but I'm taking an extended leave of absence. Oh, really? Why? I I I need to, I need to explore other things and just try and find what makes me happy in this crazy world. Life's too short. Like, I know it feels like, uh, it probably feels like I'm turning my back on the department and everything, but, you know, some of the, some of the shit we got to deal with, and, you know, we're just sort of left in the lurch. It just... Well, you're supposed to be sheriff next. It's, it'll be a vote, Todd. I, who knows how it'll go. Look, if, if the vote ends up, like, I, I thought they would have had the vote by now. Like, I've been gone, what, a week? Uh, yes. About that? No, I, you know... I don't think anything's happened. I don't know if anything will happen. And it's just... It's too much. Like, look, if they really want me as a contender for next sheriff when it finally rolls around, look, they can reach me via telegram. But, uh... I gotta put... Sometimes you gotta put your own happiness first, goddammit. Okay. So... Yeah, I've been better. How, how you doing? I'm alright. You know, I'm staying out of trouble. Yeah, I'm, I'm, hopefully I can do the same. I'm I'm actually heading to Rhodes now. I'm gonna see if I can get in touch with one of the Jones brothers to, you know, maybe I'll maybe I'll take up driving trains for a time. That uh, means you gotta leave the law department. Oh, I think on paper I leave, but you know I haven't resigned or anything. Oh, okay. So I think they can always just you know whip out the uh you know just file the paperwork away and pull it back out when needed, I guess. Yeah. Okay. So. So that's my plan. Uh, yeah, hopefully I could get in touch with someone in Rhodes. I think I think they're out this way or in Saint Denis. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. What about you? What are you doing now? Nothing. You want to come with me? Yeah. Okay. Where are you going? Uh, if I hopefully I can find someone in Rhodes to ask about it. And if not, I'll head over to Saint Denis. Okay. Oh, God, Ansburg, Ansburg, if I have to. Okay. Then, I don't know, 
Then maybe later I'll go do some hunting or something. I don't know. I'm I'm just trying to just trying to get a, a taste of that freedom everyone else is chasing and just try and find what makes me happy because it's just you know, up north I was reacquainted with a a, a bunch of the fellas I'd trained with before I moved down here and uh, well let's just say the the group of them is a lot smaller than last time I was there. A lot of those boys are now six feet under. Okay. So I'm just thinking, you know, what if you know, let's say, you know, I go back on duty and I go talk to these psychopaths like like Calder and they just they just shoot me and that's and that's it. You know. Well, what side of the county did they beat the doctor up on? I don't know for sure. See, if it was east, that's fair, isn't it? Well, as, as far as I, you know, I believe, you know, we all talked about it that, you know, we had that agreement in place. But if he broke the agreement, then it's back to, back to normal. And, like, I don't right. know if they've done anything about it. But just the fact that he went back on it is enough to... Yeah, but I thought he, he, he was supposed to do anything bad in the west side anymore. That, that's, that's what's pissed me off. We had an agreement. He said that for a time they would behave. And then literally yeah. he can't even go a week without beating a doctor to a pulp. Yeah, but was that over in the east though? Well, I think, I think Miss Wheeler, because she sent it to me, I believe it was the west. Okay. Because otherwise... She would have mentioned that it was, yeah, their jurisdiction, but I think she implied yeah. that it was the West. Okay, which doctor? She didn't say. Okay. But then she was threatened. Now, look, I'm not, you know, I'm not pissed off because it was Miss Wheel that was threatened. I'm pissed off that it was a doctor that yeah. was beat pop, And then another doctor was threatened. That's just, that's just not on. Where did all this happen? That's what I'd like to find out. Maybe we can find Miss Wheeler or some of the other doctors while we're out and about. But, yeah, I'm just going to be... You're yeah, coming down here into Rhodes, St. Denis if I have to, try and get in contact with the Jones brothers. And then, uh, yeah, I'm just going to be traveling around. I'm just going to be taking in the sights, doing some hunting, you know, maybe do some hiking. Just, just, just enjoy myself. And, you know, I don't want to, I don't want to hold you up, but you're welcome to tag along as long as you like. I'll go for a little bit. Oh dear. Yeah, I know. It's a lot to be dumping on you. I'm sorry. Does that mean Jack will now be sheriff? Well, that's the thing. I haven't resigned. It's in a leave of absence. Look, if they want to throw him in, go for it. If they want to reach out to me when they finally do a vote, go for it. But yeah. whatever happens, I'd... I don't care. Give away it goes. I don't care anymore. Can do what they goddamn want. Yo, descendant. Forty-seven months straight. Thank you, bro. Mate, just just chucking it, just doing some RP, you know. I feel that Dinger's hat's responsible for all this. Oh, of course. It all comes back. It all comes back to Dinger's damn hat. It's just hard. I like you know. Like, let's say, uh, let's say suddenly they're like, No, Hughes, please, please don't take a leave of absence. We want you sheriff. I, I don't, I don't know if, it, oh, this fellow's even, I don't, I don't know if that'll make me happy. Like, that's just more, that's just more bullshit. Yeah. I just, I don't know. I don't know what it's going to take. And I'd, I'd like the chance to find out. Oh, okay. Oh, well, I guess we'll, we'll stop in here, see if anyone's up here in the, uh, Parlor? Not a saloon, it's a parlor. Pa, it's a parlor. Anything good? No. 
Nobody here. I didn't see anyone really on the ride in. Uh, is uh, is the governor around? Beats me. Okay. It's gonna be a lot of riding around. Oh well, I guess head on into Saint Denis. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep traveling around till I okay. find people that have half a brain on their shoulders that might know the Jones brothers. Oh, yeah. I swear I wrote it down that postal ID. You don't have it, do you? No. <laughs> Shit. I just thought, what a what better way to uh to see the country, get around, meet people, and go to new places than working in trains. That might that, that yeah, you could ask Mr. Alexa. He's a train man now. I don't know if I really want to talk to him. Okay. Considering he's he was supposed to be my my form of point of contact with Calder and. He had that Pinkerton investigation. I don't think that fella can be trusted. Yeah, okay, yeah. He must be working with him as well, then. He's, he's probably... He's probably raring to go beat up a doctor as well. I don't know. Okay. I just... Not... A bit cautious, Todd. I guess it depends which doctor it was. If it was Yuri, I'd be okay. <laughs> Why, what has he done? I don't know. Probably something bad. Russians. Yeah. Look, I'm, I don't, I don't mean to sound like I got a chip on my shoulder about all Russians, but I've only met two Russians in my time, and both make me uneasy. Which one's that? Yuri and Alexei. Oh yeah. So it's not off to a good start. I need to, but I ain't about to go travel over to Russia to to find more pe more Russians to meet. Okay. So you're saying I should bring more Russians here? Excuse me! Oh! Here, listen, it's Saint Denis, my horse died. Holy shit! Hello! Yeah, jump on, where do you need to go? Saint Denis? Uh, this is Saint Denis, here, yeah, my horse died. Got eaten by an alligator! Oh, sh no, well, we're he don't worry, we're heading to Saint Denis, we'll get you there. Ah, thank you very much! Ah, sorry to hear that, partner. Yeah, you gotta watch out for them alligators out this way. A uh, horse had uh, a, a limp leg. Oh. The horseshoes uh, got, got stuck on it. They, they, they weren't bad, the horseshoes. I'm really sorry to hear that, Pawn. I don't I don't think anybody in life is prepared to see a, a horse ripped to shreds by an alligator. Oh, Dinky Dong, he was a good horse, Dinky Dong. Rest in peace, I'll Dinky Dong. I'll miss him. I will, uh, if I have a drink later tonight, I'll, I'll pour some out for Dinky Dong. Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. <laughs> Would you, would you, what is your name? Uh, my name's George Hughes. Oh, George Hughes. My name's uh, Gold Foyacho. How are you? Well, thanks. That's good. What's your name, fella? On your horse. I don't think he likes me. I don't know if he can hear. That's Todd. Hello. Todd? Hello. Hi, Todd. My, my name's Gold Foyacho. Nice to meet you. Sorry, what was that again? Doing? What was your name again? Gold Free. Godfrey? Yes. And your last name? Artichoke. Artichoke. Like the... That's a plant, right? Yeah, correct. Right. Godfrey Artichoke. Okay, I got it that time. Uh, where's best for you, Mr. Artichoke? Oh, just, 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 just here. Well, I hope the... Let's see what they have in stock. Do you need the us to wait around? Too. Thanks, Hey, sorry? Do you need us to wait around? Will you be okay? Oh, no, no, no. I'm, I'm okay. I appreciate the uh, assistance on that lift there. I'm oh, happy to help. And I'm sorry again for you, for that. No, it's okay. I'll, I'll, I'll remember Dinky Dong. I'll, I'll, I'll see if I can get a Dinky Dong too. So, oh. But thank you again. No problem. Anytime, partner. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Oh, my God. I guess we'll see if the East Department's around. Yeah, it would be good. It would be nice to see Jeb or Yard even see say hi to Dinger right about now. <laughs> Dinky, Dinky Dong.
Damn, I'm be I become so used to always seeing them outside the outside the station here. Hey, you woman. Oh, George. Sir. Howdy, yeah. Jack. Howdy. Oh, the governor's around too. It's by the doctor's office. Here in town. Yeah, he's in town at the moment. Uh, go. Help. Oh, well, good to see you, Jack. I don't know if you saw my my note I left in the office. I'm taking an extended leave of absence. Oh, okay. No, I didn't see that. Sorry about that. Yeah, so I don't mean to be dumping all the acting sheriff duties on you. It's just. That's all good. It's just I. I, I went and visited a lot of people I trained with up in Boston, and I, you know, met up. I caught up with a lot of old friends, and just okay. I just need to take some time to learn what it is that I want to get out of life before I. Oh, that's fair. So I'll, oh, you'll yeah. let the you always let the governor know that at least he knows what's going on. Yeah. So look. He's actually around for once. So look, I, you know, I'm open to coming back eventually, but it's just I just need to take some time. And, uh, but I did mention it well. If that, I, if, you know, if I learn anything that'll make y'all jobs easier, I'll, I'll be sure to let you know. Excuse me, George. Sorry, Godfrey. You all right? Oh, Mr. Hughes. Howdy again. I got Dinky Dong too here now. Look at him. Oh, look at that. This horse is fucking bussing. I tell you, he's good. <laughs> look at him trotting. What's Anyways, I see you guys around. Let's go. Bye bye. Good luck, Godfrey. What's a bus? I have no idea. That horse was bussing. I don't know. What's a, a like buzzing like a bee? So yeah, I'm just uh, I'm just riding around, just trying to if, see if I can get in touch with like the Jones brothers or something. Like oh, I might okay. I might just do a week or two as a, a train driver, just get out see the country, idea. just to you know clear my head. Uh, oh, we may as well inform the governor then. At least he knows what's going on. Uh, where'd you say he is? Oh, take it's just near the doctor's office. Let's go that way. Oh. oh he Sounds like me. a plan. It's not like it, Woodward. Where's he gone? Down to the doctor's office. Oh, he's oh, going ahead. You take time to yourself. I it's just. A good idea. Like a lot of the boys I train with. You know, there was a, a number of them when I left to move down here, but then when I got back, it's the group is much smaller. A lot of them have been killed in the line of duty. That's a shame. Which is really making me just reassess. You know, like, let's say... Let's say I got shot tomorrow. Oh, yes. What else... What have I done with my life? That's very true, actually. I'm just... You know... And again, it's, it's not like I'm... It's not like I'm meaning to turn my back on the department and all of y'all. It's just... I just gotta do something for me. Yeah, you gotta do what's best for you sometimes. So, I just, yeah, I don't, I don't want you to, I don't want you to feel like I'm just abandoning you. Oh no, I don't feel like that. I don't think that. I think you just need to do what you want to and do. Look, if I'm, time, like, say you're in trouble and I'm around, you can, uh, you know, I'll be there to lend a hand. That's fair. Oh, crap, there's people. Oh my god, god well, this is where everybody is. Yeah. Oh. It's good to see. Yeah. Horse. Okay. Let me yeah, look at there. the horse. There we go. Where'd he go? Oh. Where'd he go? Oh, there. Who do you reckon? Roped into that. Oh, Hello. Oh, it's okay. Howdy. We can rope you up. Oh, Mr. Back. Hughes. Yes. Howdy. Hey, you, 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 you're looking like you're off duty, son. Uh, I am off duty, sir. Oh, yeah. What, what, are, you, what are you getting a bit of hunting done? Oh, I was dressed like Woodman I was, Day. I was hoping to yeah, soon. Uh, I ran into Harkness here and he said I should probably in, give you an update. Oh yeah, give me, I'm I'm all ears, and, unless it's something you need to talk about privately. Oh, look, it's not super private or anything. I'm just uh, I I left a note in the Blackwater office. I'm uh, taking an extended leave of absence from the department. Oh, uh, everything all right? Oh, I just up in Boston. I caught up with a lot of old friends, and you know, learnt that a lot of old friends ain't around anymore. And it just made me think that, you know, I just need to I just need some time to take in what and just sort of r remind myself of what it is i get at joy out of in this crazy world oh no no that that's fine that's fine well look son you're always walking back you know whenever you need you know yeah, that's that's what i've explained to jack i don't mean to be leaving let, leaving him holding the bag or anything i just need to take some time and like i haven't resigned or anything it's just but oh I, I, I thought this was you about to resign to me i was about to have a private word after being like son you don't get to fucking 
resign. No, no, it's it's just a leave of absence, sir. It's just I don't I'm I'm not I'm not going in and writing on my calendar, y'all. I'm going to I'm going to find myself in 2 weeks exactly. I don't know how long it's going to take. Well, I understand, son. If you got to go on a spiritual journey, you go on a spiritual journey, son, but you just make sure you stay safe and you come back in one piece cuz I need that badge back on your shirt. <laughs> I heard opium works real well to find. Oh yourself. yeah yeah yeah. Mm -hmm. Opium's really good. Ladies. I heard. Uh, we ladies. heard. Uh, we no. heard. It's all alleged. I don't know about it, but like you know, it's alleged. I ain't alleged. huffing no opium. I'm anything. I'm breathing. It's you gonna be the nice. You don't have to huff it. I don't think. I mean, it's gonna be the nice fresh air of the mountains, or the or the opium? or the that nice oh, healthy know. smoke okay. of a cigarette, or the coal of a train. Oh, okay. Ladies, the you want to give me a favor? Of a train. I, I take back what I said before, <laughs> ladies. Can you all just? Who's going on a train? Ladies, can we go ladies, on the ladies, oh. ladies, ladies, can you do me a favor? I'm going to take back what I said before, and I want what? you to put both your fingers in your mouth, <laughs> and then just just hold it there and be just a little quiet for a second. All right. Okay. Are you coming on duty? Uh, um, okay. um, oh yeah, Mr. <laughs> Mr. Hughes, you you take all the time you need, son, and you yeah, know good woman. you let us know when you're ready. Oh, oh, we'll do, sir. And I, like I, you, I, I, you know, I'm worried about you. I'll I'll be around. You know, it's just but yeah, he's going to be around. I, uh, yeah, I'm not gonna be go, going going and abusing my, my my you know my key and everything. So I'm just gonna be. Do you have keys? Oh, I got key. Can I have a key? <laughs> oh, you, you ain't getting the key. Wow. Well, well if the, the governor might give you a key. I don't know. Well, I can't give no, you my they, key. They, 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 are key to your heart? they are not ready for that level yet. <laughs> Why? But, I don't think I'm. He's okay. I'm, I'm, that's I'm, rege I'm regretting this already. You, you, lady, you, you, lady, ladies, take, yeah. your, take, your, take your finger out of your mouth, ladies. Do you know who I was asking about you oh, every single day, thank, there, George? Oh, thank you. Who? Oh, God, every single day, seeing kid walk up to me, go, "Have you heard from George?" Oh, no, she Ooh. has. She's a doll. Hello, Get out of here. She actually, I am Hi, not joking. I will. Let's uh, say every I've other got, day. I'm gonna ask you a question. But she's asked me at least twice, three times since you've. Really? Went on your journey, yeah. Like she sent I me a swear. few telegrams. Okay, okay, I can't okay. hear shit. Uh, okay. But I, like this, right? <laughs> I just don't. I can't read oh. that woman. <laughs> okay. I don't like that, really. With, with what intentions, sir? Well, I don't know. She. Okay. I just get mixed signals. Uh, they have. Why don't you just tell her how you feel? They also have I've tried, bums, but but they aren't alive. She's. What are they? She's very she, emotionally unavailable. <laughs> Who? That might about women. We're uh, good with women. Come on, that might have. Well, I'm. I don't We're know. We're really good at relationship pair, advice. Yeah. Have you tried writing your feelings down? Yeah. Have oh. you tried speaking to her <laughs> about your feelings? Well, I did once, but then I, I walked away really quickly because I, was too scared to hear the answer. Oh, so that probably doesn't help my case. Oh um, no. Yeah, no, that'll do it. And then you know what you could do. You know what you could do is. You you say your feelings and and everything you you spill the beans and then we like hog tie you and you can't leave. Yeah, well, maybe. Ladies, I'm and not then paying you gotta hear to, it. I'm not I'm not paying y'all to give every, get everyone dates. All right. We're not. He's Go. talking about a lady. But I, I, I don't, don't mind. If sheriffs it's... are happy, does that not yeah. mean that they're gonna work better? No, no, I agree. Happy I sheriffs, just... happy life. You know. Mm -hmm. I agree. You just if. Why, why don't one on, on when you're not hired by me and you're not on my dive, he goes create, yeah, create the a sheriff. business or something. Oh, oh, governor, oh, let, oh. let me just be absolutely clear. I'm not I'm taking thirsty. a leave of absence because of Miss Wheeler. No, Miss no, Wheeler, hey. It, no, Look, uh, my, interesting. No, no. Uh, that's an interesting, interesting thing to say, Mr. Hughes. Mm, well, I just feel, like do you feel the need to like say that? Yeah, she didn't like uh, the governor. Yeah, apparently she's not too happy with me for some reason. I gotta go actually find her and find out what's wrong, but... but hey, Mr. Hughes, if you want to go on a spiritual journey or a, a journey of love, it doesn't bother me as long as you <laughs> stay safe and you come back in one piece. It's it's just going to be a lot of maybe we just... just game on a spiritual it, it might journey be, of love. I might just help yeah, out on yeah, some trains, do, do some that. hiking, do some hunting, do some camping, go explore the world a little bit. Uh, it's it, That's that's really it. Just yeah, just find what no brings you joy again. Gym. I'll be I'll be all right. Who is that? Do you need my assistance? I got this. God, my assistance. <laughs> oh, I, this is this is why you I don't. don't know what you pay those two to do? Well, right now they're not technically getting paid. They're paying off their fine. Oh Jesus! No, I, as the governor, I have to believe that the justice system, you know, can rehabilitate people and bring them into a lawful society and. 
Well, they have the two proof right now. I, I, I do say proof the sheriff's with, uh, speed also. You know, yeah, speed. Just going to legend. The only thing I've seen them do is it'll go on your ledger, boys. Don't you worry. Oh, I've got another one for you there, Governor. <laughs> oh, do, does anybody know the post ID of the Jones brothers that run the train out of roads? Well, unfortunately, I don't, it? son. No, I don't. God damn it. That's all right. I'll, I'll find them eventually. Sorry, what, you're saying something, Mr. Woodman? Yeah, I got another riddle for you. Uh, all right, shoot. Okay. Uh, I'm tall when I'm young, and I'm short when I'm old. What am I? Uh, like, I don't know. A candle. That's actually I, pretty good. I don't, I don't oh. think they're getting older. I just think they, you know, being used. Yeah, like we're being used. <laughs> <laughs> What's that guy on the ground? Oh, he walked away and uh, fell. Oh, shit happens. Mm -hmm. All right, I should probably make sure my assistants are not getting in any trouble. Mm -hmm. Y'all take care of yourselves. And uh, Mr. Sir. Hughes, you do what you need to do, son. We'll do, I'll Governor. Sure I'll wait for that telegram later. I'll be all right. And look, I'm, I'm always just a telegram away. And like I said, it's not like I've resigned. Like, I'll still be around. If, if there's an emergency, I'm around. All right, son. No problem. Oh, I've got one more for you, Governor, before you go. All right, shoot. What has many keys but can't open a single lock? What is it? A piano. <laughs> That's another good one. That was actually that. pretty good. <laughs> Buddy, oh. Woodman, you should write a book of riddles. <laughs> you can actually go to oh, the... Uh, I can hear you people down the other end of the fucking town. You can actually go, I think it's somewhere over there, and it's actually got... You can buy a book and you can write in it. Oh, well, there we go. Yeah, Woodman's big old book of riddles. Yeah, that's actually a good idea. When are you coming back on duty, Woodman? Uh, I don't know. Probably not tonight. Maybe maybe <laughs> later on in a couple of days or something. I'm yeah, just having fair. a break. Oh, yeah. It, it's needed every now and again. Yeah, it is. Not like anyone's doing crime anyway. They're too scared to go to jail. <laughs> I was hoping someone here would know one of the Jones brothers. What are, what are their first names? Is it Tom? I have no first names. Jack? Oh, Jack Jones? Jack Jones. Jack Jones one of them. He's always in roads, yeah. I always talk to Alexi. I think he's a train driver oh, now, too. Yeah. Oh, the doctors are here. Oh, dear. All right. Oh, it's Cynthia. All right. Howdy. I just realized I've been shot for about a week and a half. I'm fucked. Hello. Hi, Woodman. Light up. Go tell her how you feel, sir. <laughs> Mr. Hughes? Yeah, well, but just oh, howdy, partner. Oh, oh, oh. Miss Cynthia, I've got, I've got a riddle for you. What's what's the riddle? What can you catch, but you sure cannot throw it back? A, a cold? God, yeah, that's not real lost. I'm what? a doctor. I've been shot. She's <laughs> <and laughs> good shoes. So I'm screwed. What? <laughs> you speak Italian. Are you right? Yeah, I <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just <laughs> enjoying this cigarette. Okay. How you been, man? I got all your telegrams. I I don't know if you yeah. saw my reply. What man? I did, and I was so confused that I've been running around cool, trying to find you. Woman, oh, here, here I am. You know that was the most cryptic telegram I think I've ever Hello. received in my life. So I, I figured, I figured I'd tell Where you more in person if you wanted to hear more, rather than well, do writing you. Do you have time now? Are you with the governor? No, I just, I just met with the governor. I'm, I'm free now. All right. Do you want to take a walk? Sure. Well, probably this way. Seems like everyone's in town. Yeah, I couldn't find anybody in Rhodes, but uh, then Woodman and I head down here, and here's everybody down by the church, and it's not even Sunday. Yeah, that is a surprise. Though I think the governor draws a crowd wherever he goes. Yeah, that, that's true, and uh, so he's got two assistants now? One of them is Dottie. Yeah. Yeah, look, Cynthia, I'm really, I'm really, that was not easy to read that Cal did not only, you know, beat, a doctor will pull, but then he threatened you like that. I I nearly tore that letter up right then and there. Yeah, and I stopped sending letters, and things just kind of got worse. Not exactly with Kyle Durr, but it's been a hell of a time in the in the county. You want to tell me about it? Well, two nights ago, I got uh, strangled. What by who? I don't know the fellow's name, and it happened in Armadillo. Um, I I moved to Armadillo, yeah, and then. This guy was being very hostile, and then he claimed that I was trying to follow him, and then he tackled me from behind, got on top of me, and strangled me until I blacked out. 
What do you, what's it, what did you look like? It, he was a white guy with black hair and a black beard, red uh, shirt with um, like crisscross bandoliers on it, no jacket, and uh, he had an Australian accent. Mm -hmm. And uh, I hadn't been able to find a ranger for days to be able to report it to him because it's been quiet down there. I'll deal with it. I appreciate that. I have to say, I have missed having you around. Oh, it's only little old me, miss. I'm sure you'd be fine. George, you have to know by now that you're my favorite person around here. Oh, stop. You're just, you're just saying that. No, I don't think I am. But just with, with the cow thing, it's just been difficult because, you know, William ain't a fighting man. He got beaten to a bloody pulp. It was William? Was William got beaten to a bloody pulp, yeah. <sighs> that does That doesn't help. That does not help. You know, he's 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 almost like a hundred pounds soaking wet, that fella. <laughs> I wasn't gonna say it, but Well, we all know. He's a bean pole, he's very tall, but he he ain't, you know, a fighter. Dolores has insisted on giving us all boxing lessons and I started taking lessons with people who were teaching me. M Mr. Golden I had a, a lesson the other day and Jeb's been teaching me how to quick fire. Well, I know you've got what it takes to be a good boxer. I, I, I can attest to that. Well, that was different, I think. He just yelled insults at me with my name wrong until I hurled a punch. Even then, I don't think it was that strong. No, no, you know, you know in real situations, you know, you'll be, t you'll be, they'll be saying worse things than that. Or, uh, and then, you know, if you were, if you had that much strength at that level, I'm sure, oh, come on, let's get you out of the oh. rain. So, I shouldn't be just talking about me. How was Boston? Oh, it was, well, like I mentioned, it just, it was a lot of catching up on some old things that, you know, like I, it, I, I went out and I, I, I went out and uh, left some flowers at the, uh, at the graves. Oh. Just because I haven't uh, been up there right. since I came down here, so I did that, and it's just disheartening that. The group of fellas I trained with initially was, you know, there was a considerable number of them, but then returning, you know, to find that the numbers have become smaller and that there's more graves to visit is a... Uh... That must be hard. I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's... It's, uh... It, it gave me a lot to think about on the on the boat ride back, and, uh... Yeah, I'm gonna... I've, I've let the, uh... I've let the governor know, and I've let the other fellows know. I'm taking a leave of absence from the from the law department. I haven't, I haven't, I haven't quit, but um, I'll be, I'll be spending a lot more time. I might do some work experience on trains, or I'm just going to do a lot of hiking and hunting and things like that, just to just to find what it is that brings me joy in this crazy world. Well, if you ever need someone to hike or hunt with, uh, you know, I can make myself available. Oh, you, you'll be the first one I telegram. You know that. I appreciate that. So that's... So that's really where I'm at. Um, with... Just everything I'm trying to get sorted today. And let's just hope that... Let's just hope that... Cal, I, let's, Calder should be hoping that I don't find him... On his lonesome anytime soon. Yeah, I think Dolores had words with him about it. But uh, mm. only so much that can do. He even had words. Calder approached William today and reminded him of what happened. Really? Not even an apology? No, not an apology. Even after Dolores was talking to him, Calder and Dottie were walking through the town with their pistols drawn, just uh, trying to intimidate us, I think. And is this mainly Blackwater? The black problem water? is, in Blackwater, of course. The problem is, as well, is that William actually didn't do anything wrong. He just told Dottie she was being loud as we were inside mourning the death of a patient. William had just lost a patient that Jeb had shot. And so he just asked her politely to keep her voice and, down. And he just said, hey, you're you're a bit loud. That's all he said. And then Calder just started throwing fists. And screaming in his face about, don't talk to my missus that way. Oh, I can't believe, he can't even, that's not even a week after the meeting we had on the planes. Yeah. That's, that's not even a week. That's, yeah. that man has, clearly has no honor if he goes back. We, we, we shook hands and we smoked cigars over that talk. Look, if you're going on a leave of absence, I'd, 
you know, I can tell other people about it. I mean, they, they've all assuring me it's handled. I don't want to put you in a position where you think you have to go deal with that. Oh, I'm not going to be seeking it out per se, but uh, let's just hope I don't cross paths with him in a, you know, in a... Hey, okay, Mr. Hughes! Oh. Yeah, let's just hope I don't run into him when he's by himself. I don't know what I'll do. Try not to get yourself into any trouble for me. I don't I don't want you feeling like you have to defend me or nothing. Um, no, I would be know. doing that for any doctor. Well, any innocent, any innocent folk. That's... All right. In that case, I can't stop you. <laughs> but it may comp... I better be careful because it, it would complicate... You know, I am just on a leave of absence, but that could give them grounds to, you know, make it permanent. Well, yeah, that is true. So yeah, I, I don't know. I'll be, I'll be around, and uh, I'll let you know if there's ever a day I'm planning a particularly long hike or hunt or something like that. I could use the company. And... Yeah, I found a network of old uh, bootlegging tunnels. Oh what? Yeah, it's, it's quite vast as well. It's, it's. I was in there for ages, and then I had to leave because I got a call out to a bear attack. But uh, it was. I did not explore all of it. You'll have to show me that. I don't, don't know if I can quite imagine what you're talking about, but I'm curious. All right, I will. And what's this? What do you What do you mean William wants to take you to court? William, you did, is that what you thought that meant? Well, what? You, what? He's having a William disagreement William was trying work? to court me to marriage. Wait, you go to court for, wait. Hey, no, court for marriage? Is, no, courting is the act of trying to like have a relationship with someone up until marriage. It's courting, you're courting somebody. It is has nothing it? to do with the law. Yeah, that's what it's called. Is that what people do? Yep, and he propositioned me. You have... You have... Yeah, it has to be put in writing, does it? No, 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 no. It was, it's like a formal declaration of intent, and then I would like to officially court sort of thing. That's what he said. Re really? So... Yeah, it's the old way of doing things. It's how our families... Yeah. That act not from my world, that ain't what we do. Well, like I said, we come from different worlds. Of course. So, anyway, so you're telling um, me that, that the magic and the spontaneity of, you know, spending time with, with someone and then just seeing where, where, where feelings and that go and then just, you know, like life, just going with it. You say you got to put it, <laughs> you got to put it in a box. Yeah. And I have to say. That I ain't romantic think, at all. And I let him down in a very sudden and harsh way that wouldn't be befitting of somebody turning down a courtship i i just i kind of dropped him and left and ran away um so oh you not you're awkward. not like you, that's not like you to do that no i don't run, run away, away from no. emotions no not now not ever wouldn't know i wouldn't know what that feels like no not at all but uh <laughs> things have been tense since and then what so you can't you gotta you gotta tell him you're intense all right, hang on. But it gets funnier, though. Okay. Mr. George, did you miss the part where I accidentally sent you sent him a telegram that was meant for you? Oh, no. I was drunk after he tried that, and I sent him a telegram and, uh, that was meant for you, complaining <laughs> about him. <laughs> so if you got the one that was like, oop, I didn't send this to the right person, that was me trying to send it again the next day. So <laughs> I really, I made it worse. That poor boy. Yeah, and then... Uh, Cynthia, that know, poor boy. How old is he? He's, he's near my age. I, I don't, I've never asked. How old are you? I'm, t I'm 24. 24, Jesus. Jeez, you're making me feel old. Well, with that, you know, extra long, long grown out Boston beard, you may, you might be. I'm only 30. I'm just messing with you. No, no you're not going that far, but jeez. Mm -hmm. Look, here, here's how it's continued to happen though, is a, uh, he and I had a strained relationship for a few days, and uh, then, oh, by the way, the reason he wanted to court me is because he felt like we're we're doing too much together, as in like riding on the back of my horse and hanging out together, and he thought that was unbecoming of a civilized lady, so he had to make a make a declaration. Anyway, but you just aside, worked together. Yeah, he took it differently, I guess. What? I are y'all are y'all high life people just trying to suck the fun out of everything? Yes! Why do you think I ran away? I don't... They... Human... The, the spectrum worse. of human emotions shouldn't be put down to, well, this has happened, better tick this box, and better sign off on this. Oh, before I hold her hand, I better... 
I better ask you if it's all right. What the hell is that? Yep. And then, uh, <laughs> and then it was strange for a few days. And then he ended up asking me if I could f help him find a lady because he wants me to matchmake him now to somebody else. And, uh, and is that boy? Started... Is that boy doing work? Is that boy? Yeah. Is he? Is he all right? Is he getting Sorry, enough? Sorry, if we're not quite ready to finish with this conversation. Is he, is he, he getting enough moment. shifts at work? You're all right. Okay. Uh, my God! I'll over to the fortress that, bar. I'll see you there. That right. that poor boy, but I get it. I've you know I remember being that age. All right, but it gets worse. <laughs> it gets worse than that. So the other night after he got beaten to, to crap and everyone was stressed out because so much had happened, um, we I decided to take everyone to Armadillo for a little bit of a party. And I feel like I've been trying to spot him in the last few days and acting a lot less ladylike to a point of me wearing uh, I'm wearing pants right now, which he hates, by the way absolutely hates the fact I think they're great pants. I appreciate that but it it is me acting out of spot to be honest um but anyway we why, have this why you want to spot the poor boy because I get angry when people want me to be a certain way that's you well I don't blame you You should just be you yeah you shouldn't be worse. people shouldn't be writing up taking people to court over feelings and uh -huh. expecting them to be away you no, should I know you should just want to be but, with someone because of how they are and if they yeah, don't like well, how they are then move along so we had this gathering and we were swimming and you know they were less close than normal and everyone was swimming and singing and drinking tequila and uh the next day he pu he pulled me aside to say I really didn't enjoy that night. And I'd been thinking everyone had a great time. I was thinking, this is a great memory Why? to have with my fellow doctors. Yeah. You know, he's like, I had a bad time. I was seeing you in that position. And Joseph was singing a song with your name in it that's, that sounded like it was about you getting married. And I was real upset about that because Joseph sings his, his, you know, his Irish songs and was just having a little laugh. My and, mother's uh, from Ireland. I would have loved to hear them. It was a great song. And he put my name in it. And, you know, and he took, William took it very seriously. Anyway, I oh, think... Dear. Um, he, I think he's changing, but he doesn't like that I'm changing. He gave me a whole lecture about how, like, he's afraid that I'm going to get myself into trouble by how much I'm changing. Probably just because I'm wearing pants. That's... You can wear pants. Yeah, I know. What's can. wrong with pants? I wear pants. A lot of people wear pants. That's, well, he's taking it very, very seriously. Anyway. If you wear so that dress up little... in the mountains, you're going to trip over on a rock. I have tripped over a rock. I got that's, stuck on a chair in the Blackwater Saloon and fell over. That's why you're wearing pants. It's a safe. It's right. to make sure you're safe. Safety. Yeah. So he's he's been he's been strange. Uh, don't tell him I said any of this, no, by I the get, way. It sounds but awfully controlling. Yeah, it, it is a little bit controlling. Especially you when you said no to the about. going to court. But yeah, I ain't, I don't want to court with him. I don't. Yeah, want if you any if of that. you knock back this formal agreement of going to court with a fella. Like, that's, he should back the. He should back off. He ain't. He ain't got no say in what you do. Well, that's the thing. Now he says that he wants me to match make him with another lady, and I think that he just wants me to find him someone else so he can get over me. But it's been very complicated. But at least it hasn't stopped us from being able to work together and stitch up the same person. And Jesus, you know. But still, very strange, very stressful for no reason. While I've been also getting choked out, and he's been getting his ass beat by somebody in the street. And I so, thought I was oh. going through a lot. I think you've. I think you've got a lot tougher than me, Miss. Uh, no, I don't think so. Anyway, I've been learning how to fight. That's Good. The bottom line, I've been learning how to fight, and I don't think he likes that up. So you should, because I know I know you got a good swing. You with more yeah. training, you could kill a man with one. <laughs> Let's hope. I hope we can get to that point. Just as long as it's stop, you know, start, then, you know, you can start taking out people that deserve it rather than all those ducklings and squirrels in the forest. Oh, yeah, I got an opossum on the way here. God damn it. You gotta remember Joseph the, didn't know what an opossum the was. The ecosystem, miss. The ecosystem. If you kill all the animals, you're gonna, they'll all I, be gone. I have barely be, had time to hunt while I've been working as a doctor, by the way. That's just, good. Yeah, the other chipmunks oh. can go back to thriving. And I owe you some money. The last oh, uh, get, paint. I do. Get the fuck out of here with that owing me money nonsense. You've already paid me back for the bow and God knows what else. Nope. You don't have to be paying me back, it. miss. Nope. Now we're even. I'm still inviting you to the next dance. Well, we'll see. Doctor's life is getting very busy. Oh, yeah. I'll go by myself if I have to, but I uh, hope I don't hurt. Now I'm not. I'm not gonna write you a letter. So, could I, please, madam, uh, would it be suitable if you were to uh, join me for the the uh, upcoming <laughs> dance? I think if you ever ask me anything like that, I might actually have to punch you. Yeah, and use that good. Because I'm just, 
I'm all in, I'll invite you and you can come if you want. If not, I'll just go by myself and I'll mm -hmm. I'll have my I'll keep all them mojitos to myself. Yeah. Well, uh, I better find Joseph, and he also wanted to say hello to you, so he's gone to the. Yeah, saloon. he's a good fella. Where'd he go? Uh, good. He's where's the saloon from here? Uh. Uh. I think left because down him. that way's the the dock. Oh, and I told the governor I wouldn't be voting for him anymore. Well, did you know they haven't even organized a, the sheriff vote yet? Oh, uh, that seems like oh excuse me, madam, but may I inquire about potentially riding upon the back of ye old horse? So long as you promise not to try and marry me if you get on my horse. <laughs> oh, I've been married once. I'm not in a rush. Yep. I always, I always play it <coughs> like there is that possibility to work, but I'm not, <coughs> it's not like a primary objective. <coughs> I have no, I have no idea how it's going to go. Uh, I think he said Fortress. I don't know if this is Fortress or Silverado uh, now. Champagne. Uh, what's it? Rob. Rob is. Rob, Rob Spear. In the wrong. What the fuck does that mean? I don't know. I've been here maybe once or twice. I don't know what this is. Is there another saloon in town that I don't know? Uh, I think there might be, because this is, well, as you, as you would know, miss, this is the upper class drinking oh, establishment. Jesus. Oh, oh, you that, got that report. Oh, Joseph. Hello, hello, hello. How you doing, partner? I'm not too bad. How are you? Oh, uh, look, I've been all right. Just, it was a long boat ride back and then. Got a lot on my plate, but I'm all right. You know, oh. that is in the west side, and they've got it. That's fine. They've got it already. You sure? Fantastic. Yeah, we east side. We're fine. Anyway, yeah, Joseph here is now a full-fledged doctor. Oh, fantastic. Love Howdy, to hear. Ladies and gentlemen. Howdy, partner. Howdy. What's up? Howdy, so how have you been, George? I haven't seen you in a while. I've been up in, uh, I've been up in Boston. That's where I grew up. In Boston. That's right. I imagine you'd know the. I imagine you're probably familiar with the place. Well, I've never been there myself, but a lot of my family moved over there. Yeah, my 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 mother was from Ireland, so you know. But my father was from uh, England, so it you know it was a little bit awkward. Oh, so your father was a bastard, was he? Yeah, I guess you could say that. So yeah, you know, I, 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 I didn't really, I didn't really fit in with either. Other circles in Boston. I, you know, I just had to sort of do my own thing. But, uh, I heard you were heard you were playing some uh, Irish folk songs at a party recently. Oh, we had a little bit of a. He shares apartment. A little bit of a drink and a swim. Well, that's fantastic. Oh. Hello, oh. hey uh, Jim. Is the governor around here? No, the governor is up near Flat Neck Station where he just had a crash. Um, right. Why does George look so crash. sad now? I thought. The man down uh, by the uh, telegram station said he'd been taken by someone. No, there, there, there was a carriage crash. Right. Ooh, okay. You kidding me? That's fine. We just saw has, him leave. Has he been taken or has he been... No, nah. we got we got an official report handed to us that he's just been... He's crashed. Okay. He's, he's fine. All right, that's fine. All right. He's fine. Oh, we think that uh, William's over there with him. Yeah. Okay. All right. So he'll be looked after. Yeah, all right. Well, thank you, folks. We'll have a bath with you on here. Yeah. No, okay. Can I have a quick okay. word with you, mate? Yeah, sure. And yeah, I, I, yeah. Hopefully, yeah. Next, hopefully, uh, hopefully, I get to hear some of these songs at the next uh, shindig or whatever that happens. I'd love to hear them. Well, I think in about uh, what is it? Not uh, not this coming Tuesday or the next one, but the one after that. I think we're Taco doing Taco uh, Tuesday. Taco Tuesday down in Armadillo. So, not this coming Tuesday. Three Tuesdays from now. Three fucking, which fucking Tuesday is that? That's a lot of, that's a lot of Tuesdays. Maybe we'll be. let you know closer to the day. Tuesday, the 9th of, no, yeah. not the 9th, no. The 16th? Yeah, that's the one. Right, yeah, could you remind me between now and then? I ain't, I ain't writing down Taco Tuesday in my calendar. Well, why not? Uh, I don't know. More important things to put in it. 
more important things. I don't mean that in a rude to. way, but if I start right now what I'm having for lunch every day, I'm not going to have room to write important things. Oh, that's fair enough. We'll, we'll just let you know when Taco Tuesday's coming up. Sure. I mean, everyone, everyone talks about it the morning of and starts start spreading that word. Yeah, I'll probably be there regardless, so... Yeah, Hi, guys. I wouldn't want to. I wouldn't want to en encroach on y'all's uh, uh, doctor parties. No, the do doctor parties. I mean, we almost invited just a random what that fella Edwin. We were I was almost like, hey, Edwin, come with us. But no, it's just it just happened to be five doctors who are all good all right. at the time, and yeah. we had that horrible day where we just wanted to relax and celebrate Joseph's uh, new job. I was just really worried that I'd have to go to the effort of you know buying a typewriter and uh, learning to read, learning to write, writing up a formal letter for asking permission. I just thought there'd be a lot of... Hold on a second. Jump. You're no a way. and you don't know how to read or write. He's, he sent me nice telegrams. You definitely know how to read I'm or write. I'm joking. I'm pulling your leg. I was just thinking that doesn't make a lot of sense because I know I've I've read uh, reports that you've written before. No, no. I'm just... I got to, you know... Like everything in life, you just want to make sure you 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 know undergoing the correct procedures. You know, I wouldn't want I wouldn't want my intent to be uh, misinterpreted. That you know, I, I would Sir. would very much like I would very much like to participate in the consumption of tacos this Tuesday with your permission. He's messing with me. I feel like now Sincerely. I don't want you to Sincerely. George Hughes, and taco enthusiast. So that's your English father coming out, is it? I suppose he probably is. He was uh, up from the the north side, north. So you know he wasn't wasn't didn't you know, take I much for him to want to move. The thing about the English for me is, you know, it's quite easy to do their accent when you when you're when you're thinking about it. Thinking about being a, uh, <clears throat> thinking about being a posh bastard. Y yeah, no. Nah. That was convincing. Every, every time I do it in front of an English person, they go, "Why can't you talk like that normally?" You know, and I'm thinking that's so much effort. Fucking do that. No, I, I get that. I get that. Whereas you know, if I just talk normally, then it's much easier for me. But they don't want that. They don't care about that. They just want to be able to understand you because they can't open their ears or whatever. I can understand you quite fun. Well, you're not English, are you? So. Yeah, good point. Yeah, I feel like I'm just, you know, no offense. It just feels like I'm listening to my mother growing up, but she just happens to have a beard now. <laughs> well, if your mother's Irish, it would have gone that way eventually anyway. Oh, dear. Uh, she was she was fantastic. So yeah, no, I would definitely love to hear some of the songs sometimes. That'll remind me of uh, my my childhood. Well, you're welcome to come along. All right. Well, look. I mean, if you want to ride with us for a while, he probably will break out in song eventually. Oh well, what? Uh, I'm this, kidding. I'm not putting that pressure on this, you, Joseph. This very evening. Well, it's no pressure at all. I. Uh... I am known to break out in song. Oh, well. He is. Sure. We had a little tune on the way over here. Oh, well, you know, as long as I am not stepping on the, the toes of any innocent folk, I would be happy to ride along with y'all tonight if, if, if you would like just a bit extra muscle. Of you know, course. I might have to teach you, I might have to teach you the song that, uh, that we sang the other night, Red Haired Cindy. What? That was a good song, even if it <laughs> ruffled some feathers. Good. Well, yeah, look, I, I don't have any plans for the rest of the evening, so... All right, let me just finish this cigarette. I just, I would really just love to find the... Learn how to get in taunt, contact with the Jones brothers. That's... Who Who the hell's the Jones brothers? Oh, sorry! They run the trains out of roads. That's the second time now, Cynthia. She's got a good... No, I think your fist might be in love with my head. It's that nicotine. As soon as it left my system, I just wanted to swing. That, uh, that fist is going to take that face to court any day now. To court? That's right. Jesus. I'm, I'm trying to teach George what courting means because he didn't quite understand now. He thinks everything's going to court. You go to court a few times, then the stork comes, and then uh, all your money goes as well. Oh, I think, uh, George, you might be a bit confused there. <laughs> no, no, that's... that's... Let, let's take this to the horses. Well, I wouldn't know. I I'm, think... a, I'm just a lower-class, uneducated fool. I wouldn't know any better. 
Oh, don't tell me about that. You, you, you were what? Where did you grow up? Boston. Boston. Did you say? It fancy. Too English for the Americans, and too English for the Irish. It was not a fun time. All right. Next stop on the route is Van Horn. Damn a horse. Well, there's no sense in taking this many horses. Yep. So, oh, so. Let me check that report as well. <laughs> I love oh, it, Ash. Fucking chicken. Yep, yeah, not our circus, not our monkeys. Let's go. Not our circus, not our monkeys. It's probably suitable that I act as an unofficial bodyguard for the doctors when I can. Considering what happened to them recently. You don't have to ride slowly. I'm not on duty. Permission has been granted. I can write you a letter from the court if you'd really like. That won't be necessary. Thank God. I don't want everything to be so official in my life. <laughs> oh, okay. Except for the formal document I have that lets me punch you whenever I want. Oh, I see. Keeping up, man. I think Boston made him a little bit rusty. I'm key. I'm. I'm. I'm matching your speed. Poor Georgie's he's been kept in the stable for a week. Oh, she be. She's fine. Remember we were talking last time about mining songs? Yeah, I remember. You ever spend any time down in the mines, George? Not for a long time! Well, there's a lot of mining songs as well, man. Sing some songs about mines, you know? Work hard working. Is there a lot of funny wordplay like, what's mine is mine and mine is yours, on account of you being in a mine? And you're mining? It sounds like you should write a song about the mines, George. I, that's the only bit I got. I I can't come up with more words. Oh, what, what was it? Some people say a man is made out of mud. Well, a poor man's made out of muscle and blood. Muscle and blood and skin and bones, it's a mind that's weak and a back that's strong. You load 16 tons, what do you get? Another day older and deeper in debt. Oh, St. Peter, don't you call me, cause I can't go. Well, I owe my soul to the company store. Oh, yeah, I think I may have heard that one before. 
I was born one morning when the sun didn't shine. I picked up my shovel and I walked to the mine. I loaded 16 tons of number nine soul. And then my boss said, well, I bless that coal you load. 16 tons, what do you get? Another day older and deeper in debt. St. Peter, don't you call me, cause I can't go. Well, I owe my soul to the company store. If you see me coming, you better step aside. A lot of men didn't and a lot of men died. But I got one fist of iron and the other one steel. And if my right one don't get you, then my left one will. No, I'm only joking, George. I'm not actually threatening anyone, okay? What do you, what do you mean? Well, Sheriff, we are not threatening anybody. Oh, no, of course not. No threats are happening here. Oh, jeez. That's uh, Valentine as well. Yeah, that's Valentine as well. It's fine. I think it's the same report as the person uh, who... Oh, uh, yeah. They, they seem to be right on top of each other. But you know, in the right context can be... Never mind. I don't know, might have to go through the cult system. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> all right, George, I really think that you might be a little bit confused about uh, the whole court and thing. No, no, it's a civilized society we live in now. We gotta, gotta do everything by the book. He ain't gonna forget about that <laughs> sentence I told him. <laughs> he ain't ever gonna let me live that down. Right. I'm feeling like there's uh, elements of this that I might be missing. I just filled him in on the, the the offer that I was given. So if someone wants to take me to court, I hope it's the fun kind and not the bad kind. The fun kind of court? That's right. I definitely think you might be confused. I suppose both ways you, you, you still lose some money. That is true, I guess. <laughs> oh, you know, there's one about the police, actually, George. Oh, really? Is it in favor of the police or is it marking them? I think it's a, uh, well, it's actually a Scottish song, so oh. I don't know if I can do it. Well, you know, it's actually about sergeants for uh, the army, not uh, now that I think about it more. Oh, so it's about, about the, mil the military, sergeants, not the... Not the police. No, there was a little bit about the police in uh, in red-haired Sinti. Oh. Yes, that's true. Oh, really? What's, what's that part about? It's about a policeman who comes along and... Uh, tells me that I... Well, tells the, the character in the song that they broke the law. Mm. And then uh, some stuff happens to him. Right. You know, but nothing, uh, nothing too violent. No, no serious mishaps. Maybe just some, you know, not crying over spilt milk or anything serious. I'll, I'll tell you, it goes like this. A policeman came around the corner and told me I had broke the law. My donkey kicked him in his ankle. He fell down and broke his jaw. That's unfortunate. Just a nice little accident. Nothing, you know. Yeah, nothing too bad. There's a camp up there. Yeah, there's been a lot of campsites popping up. There's one at the Aurora Basin. I got a few calls from this week as well. They might be camping out by your legendary beaver. Oh, I went by and checked that yesterday. No one's camping there at the moment. Is this the real beaver or the one in Valentine? The real one. I've taken George to try and hunt it a couple times and we've messed up. Oh, let me check with that. Yeah, I, I've learned I'm not very good at hunting beaver. George. What? That's probably true. 
It's all Valentine. It's well, they, the same one. You know, they, you know, they, they're small out in the river, and if they get close, they're gonna bite your legs off. They, they, they're scary little beasts. This way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's all Valentine. So <laughs> it should be fun. <laughs> William does have Louisa. To have and to hold. Well, I don't think she likes him like that. Oh, I think this is Jeb's camp. Oh, yeah, this really? Is Jeb's camp. Mm -hmm. He had a call out here the other day because uh, he got injured by a cougar, and this is where he proposed to Lily. <laughs> He was telling me about it. Are you on right there, man? There's a deer. I'm just trying to tell. Oh, it's gone. George. Jeb proposed here to Lily. Did you find out about that yet? No. They're they're getting married. I think that's sweet. Someone's over there. Hope they've done their paperwork in the court. You can ride behind this waterfall. That's how I was coming up here. Who's that now? I don't recognize him. Wow, here, huh? Whoever it is is just hunting. Right behind the waterfall, you say? Yep, we'll take him through there in a minute. George is making himself comfortable on. I'm sure Jeb won't mind. Jeb and I are friends. I mean, Jeb and Lily did have a very private date up here. Who knows what's happened on that couch? You're a that's brave very, man. That's very true. Right. Moving on. You might find that that is prime beaver hunting territory right there. Oh, the beaver's not in this river. Of course, how silly of me. It's like the next one over. <laughs> <laughs> this is my favorite. Uh, it's so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, dumb. Hey, <laughs> dumb. Fucking hell. <laughs> oh, other news. Uh, George. Mm? Alexi and Miss Honey split ways. Oh, no. Yep. Oh, that's a shame. Well, that's true, though. Yep. Why? What'd he do? I don't know. He's just been running around real drunk. Probably deserved it. Not her, she's lovely, but him. I don't think Georgie wants to go over there. see shit we couldn't have gone on foot we had to go on horseback did we yeah that's that's kind of the beauty of it you can ride a horse through it okay i just don't want That is. Did you ever fight in the army, George? Uh, I did a little stint in a militia, but that was about it. Nothing infantry serious. Infantry or cavalry? Uh, just infantry, I guess. Right. 
never wanted to be in the cavalry. I had other responsibilities. Fair enough, I suppose. I mean, he's also not able to keep up with us when he's on Georgie, so who knows how well that I'm, we got. We ride, in the law department, we ride in formation, and we ride according to the speed of the lead horse, miss. One time I also had an excuse. In the doctors, we ride as fast as we can, no matter what. Well, I suppose leading by example is a good strategy. There's a sense of urgency when you got lives to save, you know. Is that why we're riding along a train track in a narrow canyon? Absolutely. Tunnel out of county? I think I took the wrong turn. I'm not sure. Yo, crude! No, it can't be. Well, let's go no, have a look. No, it's not. Yeah, we can we can go through. Come on, Miss Wheel, I live a little. I've been doing a lot of living while you haven't been here, George. Oh, Alright. I can barely see for shit. Oh boy. Maybe hold the lantern up. Nope. nope, I'm doing living. Yeah, maybe live a little, George. I've done my fair share of that, thank you very much. And just like that, like a lot of things in life, you do come out on the other side. But if you don't, well, that's sh that's a bit shit. Unlucky. That was started off very poetic of you, and then it just—I don't know what that turned into. It fell off a little bit, didn't it? Sure did. Sorry, things are a bit rough around the edges here in the real world, man. The hell you mean the real world? I've been living in the real world while you've been away dallying around in Boston. I know. I know. You you've now joined the uh, the, the the wearers of pants. <laughs> yep. Much to people's dis dismay. Although it did make me virtually impo impossible to see. Uh, as soon as I started wearing pants, nobody ran anymore. And people were walking past me having the most uh, interesting conversations. Shall we head for that one? Yep. Let me have a look at that. I suppose I haven't been around to give them something better to talk about. Now they got to talk about pants on women. I've responded to it, but we're close enough, I think. Doctor en route to route. <laughs> okay. I'm happy to go and do it if you'd prefer. No, we can go. Let's go. Hotland oil field. Look out! Oh, we're good. And sorry, that was my fault. I caught the horse. And Thanks for the lurk, crude. Might see you tomorrow night. I'm not 100% sure yet. A spot of Halo would be good, though. I just don't know yet. When we get to where we're going, let me bring up my Google Doc. I think I have it written down there. Henry needs a rest for a second. Poor Henry. He was too busy outpacing Georgie and George. He just needs to kick someone. It's probably been a minute. Well, Henry's been through a lot this week. He's been shot twice. Oh my god. And oh, Henry. He fell off a cliff. But no! Oh, Henry! You've been giving him lots of chin scratches? 
No, because then he kicks me sometimes, and you know, it's hard to say whether he deserves it or not. Probably because you're not doing it right, goddammit. Here's the oil fields down there. there Speeding are up. Lucky you're wearing pants, miss. This, it can get a little bit dirty down in an oil field. Okay, Coming here around. We are. Yep. Here we are. Yo, for TK doing? Are we going on foot, are we? Zach, can you hear us? Oh. What in the hell happened to what you? What happened here? to you? I got shot. You see, you got shot. Who shot you? And where do you where are you hurting the most? My chest. Yep, I can see that. I'm gonna check the perimeter. Let's have a look. Oh, his pulse is not. Uh, oh yeah, let me let me quickly bring up my um, Google Doc. Do you want to manage his uh, pulse, and I'll get graphics card, treated. graphics card, graphics card. Oh Let's take a look. Um, do, 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 do. Where Just would I have that, written uh, that? PC hole. build. Here we go. My graphics like card is a. I'm not too. Uh, if this is up to date, it's an Asus uh, ROG uh, we'll GeForce RTX 2060. Well. Feeling a bit better. And can I'm... you tell us your name? I think. Did you say your last name was Buck Creek? <laughs> oh, been on that free rat. I was confused for a minute. I just want to make sure. I just, I'd love to just one day fork out and get like a super good graphics card, but it's just, they're so expensive and it's like, I mean, I might wait until like the next GTA is out before I go buy and like a, you know, a super good graphics card. So like, I've got a full-time job in that, but it's not like I'm making serious bank either. But um, you know, it's good. Like I can I can stream the average game at, in HD at 60 frames per second. And you know, I can have the graphics reasonably well, so it's not like it's potato game. Oh wow, you chewed on that? What are you part beaver? It could it could look better, but you know, I think it still looks good. It does the job. <laughs> Gotta have those 60 frames per second. Thank you for the gifted to twerk. Thank you very much. Might be out. Out here. Are you there, sir? Wakey, wakey. Uh, oh. There we go. I think I there found his is. hat. Oh, good news then. Man's um, got his life and his hat. Just over there. Okay. You want to help me sit him up, Joseph? I'll get this bandage around his chest. All right, no problems. All right, and he should be ready to get up. Now, sir, I'm gonna give you a shot of morphine and a little bit of stimulant. This is gonna get you on your feet real quick, but I need you to take a deep breath and take it slow, take a drink of water, and uh, then we'll have a chat, all right? all right? Stand back a little bit, George. I don't wanna accidentally stab you like I stabbed myself <laughs> that one time. Okay. Oh, shit. Now, just for lucidity's sake, can you repeat your full name for me again, sir? My name's Why? Buck Cream. Buck Cream. Well, mm -hmm. what are you doing up here? Well, I was uh, going to a location to take a donkey, and uh, these fellas came out of the bar. One guy came out of the bush, but I had my gun out, and then I shot him in the head, and then I got boned from some other bush. Then his mate came out and uh, farted on me, and they both took off. They farted on you? Yeah, the second guy farted on me and took off. 
That's disgusting. Well, uh, I'm going to give you a little bit of a herbal paste here as well in case you get what we call pink eye. Watch out, oh, there's a local coming up. You have to wait a minute, partner. We'll go around, okay? Uh, if your ass starts getting itchy or anything, you need to apply that paste to it, all right? Now, if you're, you know the drill. If your wounds get at all yucky looking, red and flames or anything, you need mm -hmm. to come find us straight away. Keep that wound dry and keep the bandages dry. I definitely will, right. man. And I will no doubt see you in Valentine anyway, so if you need your stitches removed at any point, just come and uh, tap me on the shoulder. I'll, I'll take care of you. All right. Thank you guys for your help. All right. What they take? Uh, nothing. They just wanted to fart on me. That's a very nice rifle. I'm very, I'm actually very surprised they didn't take that. Uh, no. I think they were already uh, after uh, the, the fun of killing, I reckon. What a bunch of bastards. Yeah. All right. Thank you, guys. I might be a good time to stop by Valentine and see if we can link up with the others and maybe switch sides. Because no doubt they're still there. I don't doubt it for a second. Oh, you're all right. How's your Henry doing? Uh, he's still alive and powered by Spite. Powered oh, by Spite. Try and keep up, George. Yeah! Valentine, right? Yep. You're out with going to Valentine? Yep. I think that is a patient. Where the hell the other doctor? Howdy. Y'all need help? Oh. Oh, howdy, ma'am. Howdy. Well, not really. I'm just taking out the trash. Well, I kind of so need I'll that. just put trash. him down right here. There's a, few in, there's a few inside the doctor's surgery there. Oh, I'm God. Take this one inside as well. All right. Do you mind putting pressure on his wounds while I go and check on the others? Sure thing. Applies pressure to wound. Okay. Hold on, partner. We'll have you sorted in a minute. The other doctors are George? here. Oh, what happened to this man? You'll have to ask the expert here. I have no idea. All right, sir, can you hear me at all? All right, fella, you all right there? Oh, hey, Dolores. Hey, there's one in the back room at the doctor's surgery. If someone wants to take that one. All right. Uh, oh, I am, yes. Oh, it's, it's me, George, Dolores. I, I'm just applying pressure. All right, okay, friend. no problem. Can you hear me? Uh, do we have a spare per day, Do you want to take this fella or I'll take the one in the back then? Or? Uh, uh, Ma'am. Oh, sorry. Uh, doctor, they yeah. were, you know, hassling us. So could we actually uh, have... <gasps> Oh shit! Oh, shit. Oh, what the fuck? Who the fuck are you shooting in my fucking town? I dropped you like a piece of meat. Good shooting! Mr. Creed, was it? Yeah, that's right. Holy Big shop shooter in this county. Jesus Christ, good shot. Oh my god. Wait, wait, since we're splitting. I gotta know. Wait, did, you, did he shoot my sister? Just pop this All one right. here. I'll, I'll just put him in the corner. Over. Jesus I'm Christ. I'm gonna start by taking off your top. All right, sir, can you hear me? What the fuck is going on in this town? Cool. 
does that hold you if this fella oh, didn't stop go. following okay. me? You'd I think have I another can see it. Shot. it looks like a Jesus, it looks like a rifle shot. Oh, I'm not okay. sure what it was. Is this the one you shot, oh, George? That's definitely a rifle. No, Mr. Creek guy. Never I've seen one. Mr. Creek guy. Right. Yeah, he's way too. He's much quicker than oh. me. Might be a bit of rust. Goodness, they just, just shoots the doctor or someone. That's insane. Hey, can you hear me? Uh, hello. You okay? Oh, my head is really hurting right now. I'll apply pressure to this guy. Jesus Christ. Who the hell did he shoot? What happened to I me? think he shot Miss Creed. He got shot, sir. I was shot? I think so. Do you remember Who what happened me? to you? My head is just really hurting. I don't... Your head? What happened to your head? I, got, I, got, I think I got knocked out. No! 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 Oh, you were carrying me. I might have got shot. I they, can't tell. They got the cat as well. Okay, we'll say you got pistol whipped and knocked out. Hey. Shit! They, they got my cat. They got the cat. They got my cat, sir. Oh, not oh, the cat. Start, no. I don't think the I don't think the like, cat's who, breathing. Who killed it? They, they killed my cat. They might have been caught in the crossfire. They killed my cat. Oh, that's that's it. Next person that kills an animal or a man or a woman. We need to find who they did gonna this. They're going to say that's John Dusty. Who? We need to find this. They can't. Who fucking shot the cat? They can't keep getting it. They can't keep getting I swear to stuff. I swear to God, if I find who shot this cat. It's probably goat that flop. I think the fat man killed the cat. Oh, the fat Scottish guy. Right I there. won't put him in the prison. I'll put him fucking under the prison. Put him in the grave. Now, I don't know if this gentleman is one of the people who shot at Crete. I don't know. At this point, I'm confused if I need to get him up on his feet straight away. Or what someone, I should be doing. Please help me. We'll get to you, sir. There's like five patients here. Oh, I can't really see right now. Oh, we're going out here. We got one patient over there. I think this one was one of the shooters. I don't know if I should be getting him up straight away. Dolores. Could you please save my cat? Dolores, thank you. We don't, we don't look after cats. I'm sorry. Oh. Just keep treating him, uh, Cynthia. We just got to get them all up. Get them all out right. of here. No. All right. Just giving you a shot here. That'll get you on your... Nope. All right. Let's have a that ain't good now news. listen, sir. Animals, we're not we're sorry not veterinarians in here. We can't help yet. the cat. I'm sorry. Hold on one second. I know, oh, sorry. I know it's horrible. It's gone. I, it's gone. gone. Yes. I'm sorry about that. Uh, me? No, this fella. Way I thought you were asking yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. I'm treating this fella. All right. That guy ran out the back door. I think. Sir, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna need your help. Didn't even this. get his name for our report. He better run. I, I was ready in case he tried anything. Did he shoot the cat? Till I learn otherwise, according to me, he did. Shoots a person out of the blue in the, in the right, street. Because we ain't paying no tax. None of the businesses here are paying tax. That's Creed, if by any chance, you do you know the name of the gentleman that I was fixing? Did he have the blindfold over his eyes? Hey, no, the other one. No, but they're all the same posse. Oh, God. They want right. to tax the businesses of uh, Valentine. 500 bucks. Right. <laughs> no, that no, no. I'm, uh, I'm part of the uh, posse. I'm the Creed. Creed Posse in town. We we look after Valentine. Mm. 
No worries. Thank you, sir. Appreciate your hard work, as always. This motherfucker's hat. <sighs> All right, well. Oh, there's that, my that was suddenly a lot Sorry. of work. That's fine. Yeah, I, I did say here comes trouble. <laughs> Everywhere you go, the trouble is. Have you ever noticed that? No, they came here. No, but you happen to always be that suspicious. So. Hey, brother. Oh, well, I can say no. Yeah, sure. Text the doctors if you'd like. I'm kidding. Don't text <laughs> us. We don't make much money as it is. Hey, there was a guy that was uh that shot my dad from like down the road there. Oh yeah, I got shot in the back from miles away as well. Yeah, but I uh, ended up hitting him from from here because I was like, wait, yeah, this guy I just shot my fella. sister. So I shot him, and when I was talking to him, he was quiet as a. Did I say a single word? He didn't say a single word to me, and I couldn't get his name for our report, and he's gone now. He ran off. What oh, sort of shit weird. is that? Is that what we're doing as well? Mm-hmm. Rolling around, just picking people it was, up. Um, it was Goat, Goat Masters and his um, guys. Oh, okay. They want, so what... uh, they want 500. They were pressing the, apparently, um, pressing the store staff earlier. Um, but they want, they want, uh, $500 from every business in Valentine as a tax to them. Who's oh, this? Montgomery's 2.0? Yeah, Montgomery's 2.0. Montgomery's. These motherfuckers out of county as well. We're going to disband him like we did the Montgomery's. <laughs> That's just shit. Ah, uh, oh, damn. Why do people come to There's Valentine trying to... There's plenty other towns to yeah, tax, exactly. Man. They don't have to go shooting cats in the meantime either. Who the fuck Who shot, shot a, a cat? cat? The disrespect. Those things are like snakes, They're like snakes with, fur. with fur. One of those. That Montgomery son of a bitch. Couldn't just couldn't oh, just leave it at shooting a person. Oof. Has to shoot a goddamn cat Wait, as well. That was what did the cat do? Up. No, no, it wasn't Montgomery. Oh, I've already left the county. It. We we ran him out. Well, it was I, mad. I ran out of morphine before even coming well, What are these? What's that oh group called? God. We don't know, and we, and we don't care. The governor and Get him the fuck out of here. Oh, okay. they so sometimes were blue a... and black, or they sometimes were what they were wearing tonight. That was red and black that All was wearing four the same. Ran their cart up a cliff. Mm. No, no, it was, it was just like neutral. Right. Neutral and black. It's, it's so these black. were the guys they were trying to rob the bank the no. other night, and they started shooting at the gun store? Yeah, that's correct. Yep. And now they're coming icy for money. Yeah, oh, right. preoccupied. Yep. Uh, Damn, oh, and I was sorry, good, I was good to that I'm actually still doing stuff. I came in and remember oh, when he was just a wee boy. Shop around. Excuse um, me. His first rifle. I'm leaving stuff in the ledger for you guys, so the morphine will be the last thing I leave. Um, so yeah. keep keep stocking up, okay? All right. Um, keep an eye on the news newspapers, and that'll be your last call to stock up before I go off. Shopping. All right. Before I sorry, go to sleep. Are there any vets? I'm tired. Wrong choice of words there. I will take the Ansberg call if you want. Get back over the east. Uh, I have a bunch of reports to do. I have like right. 12 people to report on, so I'll well, be here for right. a while. Ansberg is good. Uh. Alright, I'm gonna keep going in here. Come on, Joseph. Oh, then I hit the ring. I think Joseph's daydreaming. Oh no, there he is. You all ready, Joseph? Shit, I barely had time to... Joseph, what are you doing? There's another report. It says there's another report. All right, I'll take uh, Ansberg. That good. All right, he's splitting off to Caliga Hall. We're going Ansberg. Right, not that she needs a Joseph, but you now she might need an extra pair of fists. Hey. Oh my God, do you want to get on my horse? You know, since you're so slow. I'm faster. You can jump on the back of my horse. No, come on then. Oh. Look out! Shit. Watch where Hold you're on. going. Hey. Ah. Oh shit, she might actually be faster. Come on. 
<laughs> I think they're the same speed, but it will come down to who's got more stamina. Catch it up! That's because Henry needs a rest. Poor Henry. <laughs> Georgia don't need a rest yet. <laughs> How would Georgie not need a rest? Isn't Georgie also a Kentucky Saddler? Georgie is an individual. Georgie certainly is. Georgie wears pants. I can see that. Let me just, I need to fix my uh, call out <laughs> compass. <laughs> Who's a good girl? All right. They're, they're not far from the water in Ansberg. That's concerning. They're, they're behind some buildings. I didn't realize y'all did so much riding around. What do you mean you didn't realize? That's, whole, that's the whole job. I feel like you're riding to more things than we do on the average law patrol. Yeah, we do. Because y'all don't respond to wolves and bears like we do. We we deal with another kind of animal. The Walter Gold. No, I'm talking more like the cow does and the... What other creatures come out of the swamp? He's a vicious beast. <laughs> Let's go cut across. Ain't you daring? My goodness. Being, being led mean? around by a lady. I don't think this lady likes having her hair brushed no more. This lady just rides straight through a fucking forest. Oh, you saying I've, I've changed? Don't you be telling William that he'll have a heart attack. Oh, that poor boy. The moment he sees me drinking tequila straight out of the bottle, he basically had an aneurysm. <laughs> he needs to lighten up. Everyone's been telling him that. The Commodore even gave him a joint. Excuse me? The Commodore has a license and he didn't tell William what was in it when he handed it to him. He oh thought it was no, tobacco. that that poor boy. Look, some of these people like you it seemed like you were you were oh, speed up? Okay. Like you were it sounded like you had done the you know, you were prepared, but other people like poor William, they need to they need to realize what they've gotten themselves in for coming out here. If not, if they can't handle it, they need to go home. Zoom, zoom, zoom! <laughs> Back on the train tracks. You all right back there? Henry's having a moment. It's fine. We'll keep on. And I'm getting a little bit of a headache for some reason. Why? When was the last time you had know. a cigarette? Like five minutes ago. Shit. I put it out to get on the horse. Shit, no wonder you're getting a headache. This weather ain't going to help. You're going to... Where'd you... Where'd... 
Where'd they say they were? Uh, not far. Just we'll get, we'll get there. We're in. Oh, there's what's that over there? I think we're coming up. Yeah, they were behind some of the buildings that are closest to the water, I think. So we should come up on them, up on them naturally here. Right. Right here. Oh, I, I see him. I see. Yeah. Howdy. Nope, that's not him. All right, who? Oh, no. Over here. Wait, who? Uh, ha no, run, one, dude. You're gonna get shot. Where's that coming from? Over this way. I'm here. Oh no! no I'm kidding. I'm kidding. What the? It's just the oh, girl. Just you're girl. scaring it's, me. Sorry, sorry. It's just the girl. All right, what's happening here? So we were hunting, and then um. Monty shot, but then he hit her with the butt of a gun, and we crashed, and she got knocked out. Oh, all right. Let me make sure that nose isn't broken. Maverick, you can get up now. My pretty the nose. Is up. Oh, oh, oh. No, I walked her over the back of the head, and uh, so she just had a bit of a bruise. I see the light. Very gently now. I'm just looking at your head. Hey, you're going to have a nasty goose egg on the back of your head here. Another one. Yeah, you're really good at getting goose eggs. <laughs> this is gonna be, I think, my second or third goose egg. All right. Well, since you are frequent frequent uh, visitor of the doctor's <laughs> services, now you know exactly what I'm gonna be doing, don't you? <laughs> I'm going to be giving you some pain relief to get you on your feet and yes, some stimulant. And then I want you to take it easy. And I want you to probably sit down and take a, take a sip of water for me. And uh, mm -hmm. you need a monitor for the signs of con concussion. But we do have the, the typical questions here. Now, what year is it? Uh, the 19... The 1900. It certainly is. And do you know my name? Dr. Cynthia. That's right. And do you know the name of the gentleman in red next to you? That's Alexi. All right, the well, sexy. Yeah, I heard something about sexy Alexi back at stables. Some. No, I got my job back. Does sexy Alexi know, know the post ID of the Jones brothers? Uh, as in Edward and um. Yeah. And, and Jack, hang on, let me check my address book. No, after this, please. Sorry, I didn't mean. So I didn't mean to cut you off, miss. It's fine. It's just a goose egg. Surprise. <laughs> is it right. you, George? It is. Now, how do you feel? Oh, how was your trip? It, I think you... I'm okay. Alright, and I'm also going to need It was in Latin. Just tell me your full name. Um, uh, 84. Is that Edward? Uh, for the trains? Duh. That's Edward Jones? Duh. Thank you. You wouldn't happen to have the other brother's ID, would you? Uh, Jack, no, sorry. I only grabbed Edwards when I wanted to work at the trains. That's all right. So you work for the Jones brothers? No, no, I worked for... Uh, I used to work for Dex, but I got my job back at the stables. And back Blackwater, now that's reopened. All right. Would you say the Jones brothers are good to work for? Jack um, Jones well, is they, 39. They offered me oh. a job if I failed my um, application with Dex. So I... I and I, I have regular good conversations with this man. I like them. They seem pretty good. Uh, Jack is a good hunter. Oh, good. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. Thank you. And uh, uh, thank you, partner, for the uh, for Jacks as well. Yeah, thirty nine. Thank you. I pre appreciate appreciate that, Phils. Good. Not a problem. Hey, when you're ready to upgrade your horse, you come see me. We'll do. Gotta make some more money just, first. Just think, if uh, you want it to be sexy, you come see Alexi, okay? <laughs> All right, Alexi. Thank you very much. Alexi, how much is an Ardennes? A uh, uh, what? Oh wait, sorry, I should know this. I think it's, it's French, Ardennes. miss. I think it's more it's... like Arden. No, it's Ardennes. You sure? I'm sure. That's how you'd say it, even if it was French. Okay. Um, usually six seventy-five, <laughs> but obviously we do discount for doctors. Uh, probably five seventy-five. Oh, wonderful! Yeah, I'll start saving up. I, and I, you know, I got like three hundred now. I think two hundred, maybe. What was that? Yeah. What was it? That's 
But uh, don't worry, I'll take care of Maya. Just, uh, make sure she yeah, I appreciate that. And I'll, I'll talk to you about... Why did a snake get thrown at me? Sorry. I thought you need the fangs. No, I do. I'll take it. Hang on, let me put out my cigarette. <laughs> oh, no. No, don't make... Don't let her do that. I, I can't watch. I'm about to feel like a No. Fan. No, get fucked. No. I want to watch. <laughs> no. the snake fangs. It's ranted though. Don't. Oh, wait. Don't, well, don't I mean, encourage that. Do, do the doctors pay for them or you wow. just take them? No, we just take them as donations. Oh, God. I can hear it. Wow. No. Sorry? Is your lucky number 56? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, hang on. Let me check. <laughs> Oh, oh no! Get that the fuck away from me! I oh, don't nibble on yeah. it. Oh, thank you, thanks. I usually give them to Yudi, oh. but I've been them in the wall. I appreciate. it. I'll put it in the same storage he would as well. So. Oh. That was you. Oh, get the fuck out of here! All right, George, are you fine now? You need to throw up or something? Uh, no, no, I don't need to throw up, Miss. I, I, I might wait till I'm wearing a suit. I think this man's trying to do that. Yeah, just I just feel like I just feel like there's a there's a much more opportune time to to throw up to, to throw up. You know, I just feel like yeah, why, why now? Why why not yeah, wait? Be, why not wait until a better moment? You know, that snake didn't taste nice. So. Oh, keep it yourself. Oh, come on, let's get get on Henry. Oh God. Oh. Ugh. Oh. That poor snake. I can't believe I'm saying that. What was that? That poor snake. I know it's dead, but... Yeah, but the fangs go on to make antidote to save lives. Mm. Well, that was... That was, uh... That was good. I got the... Do you the... actually want to share a horse now? Fine. You've proven your point. But Ryan, on the back of yours, that don't make me any less a man. No, I never said it did. Hmm. Yeah. I'm just, I'm just being polite. Stop. You, you're being. You, what? <laughs> you're, you're overthinking everything. He should never have told you exactly what uh, what William had said. <laughs> I'm fooling no, with you. I'm I fooling know. with you. Just, it was a bit embarrassing. Come on, this. Cynthia. You know I just. Um, you know, you don't have to be so tense around me. You know, I'm just pulling your leg. Look, I'll have to tell you, it, it ain't anything like that. I've just been tense for like the last few days. Oh, I, I know you missed me. It couldn't have been that bad. No, it ain't like, no, it's just all the violence happening. No, That's no, I, I know it would have been really hard. I know it would have been so look, hard. It wasn't just you, to be honest. With, it, with Every sort of area of the county had a distinct lack of sheriffs. I know, you know, I, I, I leave a, I leave a big void. I know, I'm, I'm sorry. So I'm sorry. You are incorrigible. I, that's, I do like to encourage people to seek out their <laughs> that dreams. That's correct. Not what that word means, but you, you're welcome to stop by a library and grab a dictionary and research that later if you like. A what? You don't know what a dictionary is? To dictate? No. Dictionary is like a big book full of words that are big, and then you understand their meaning if you look it up. Any pictures? So, sometimes, but not really. Oh god, I like the pictures. Sometimes, if it's like a if a meaning warrants having a picture, there'll be a picture. What about? Did you hear they're making a sequel? A sequel to a dictionary? Yeah, the Saurus. I I know what a thesaurus is. Yeah, it's a uh, like. I think that's really how, exciting. How do you know what a thesaurus is, not what a dictionary is. I, I think the idea of writing a follow-up to any to a previous book is quite brave. That is true. I wonder I if they. If you want to think of that way. You think they might make it into a trilogy? I don't know what what they else they would write in, in, with a dictionary and a thesaurus. Maybe. Probably words. Ha uh ha. -huh. <laughs> You, you wish I was back in Boston yet? Yeah. Oh, no. Damn. Oh, dear. So where's your next, uh, where's your next doctor appointment? Uh, we're free. We're patrolling now. Patrol? We're patrolling? Is that what we're doing? Yep. We patrol all the time. I, I'm constantly just rounding the county now. Looking for chipmunks that have fallen out of a tree? 
Hey, at work it's more serious than that. I've still got the blood of those three men on my hands. Yeah, no, they, that, ain't, they, that ain't no laughing matter. Yep. You just wait until one day when I have to get a bullet out of your chest, you'll be, you'll be thankful. Ah, when am I gonna get shot? I've looked at your medical record. Why are you, why are you being nosy in <laughs> my kidding. medical records? I'm kidding. Miss Wheeler, I am an open book. If you have qu any questions, I would be happy to answer them. No, I'm just kidding, but I assume that by your reaction that they're colorful. I've, I've, I may have had my fair share of accidents, but that don't mean that... Uh... Never mind. Yeah, so now I'm thinking I should look at your record. No! I... Everything's there! Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So where you said you found, what did you say you'd found? A, a drug running tunnel or something? Oh, a, uh, I think it was like an old smuggler's tunnel or like a. Where'd you say that was? Uh, near Roanoke Bridge. Is that near here? Just saying, if, not, if no, no urgent matters, if we're nearby, you may as well show me now. Chicken. I'll I'm... be. Well, it's the the problem is, is that it's quite close to Ansburg. Yeah, that's and, where uh, we just were. Yeah, but I was getting major headache. <laughs> so I was kind of keen to get away from it. Oh, I see. I think some mob. Right. I. I can uh, Yes. You know. You, you're gonna need a lot more cigarettes than we got on us. I imagine. Yeah. Uh, I just ran out of today's stash. So. No, oh, that's that. That's understandable. I haven't been around to. Give you your cigarette no, pocket money. there's people who try to hand them to me, but I've, I've oh. had like, I'm on like 12, 15 a day. Oh, oh, other people are giving you cigarettes? Yeah, William likes to give me cigarettes. Oh, that, that just won't do it. Oh, that, oh my goodness gracious. That's, oh, well, if oh. they're free, I'm going to take it. Oh, miss, that, that just... No, look, I think it's a part of the big fact that I've had some chili rage about me the last week or so. So people what? think that if they give me a cigarette... Chili what? Nice to chili rage, like I'm cold, but I'm angry. Cold, but... So, cold, but angry. Chili rage. Hell hath no fury like a... Cold what? lady? Something, I don't know, but I think people have been plying me with cigarettes to try and make me happy. Why, why haven't you been happy? What's got you down? Well, it might be the spate of violent attacks against uh, doctors. Oh, that's a given. No, it, it w I was told that that wouldn't happen, being a doctor, that people would respect this. Yeah, and I was also told that a certain someone would honor their side of a gentleman's agreement. Yeah, uh, I was, yeah, when he did that, I just thought that whole deal was shit. But you had to have known as well, though, when a guy rocks up with 15 black horses or however many you said it was and, and does a show of force of that, the, the, the scale's already deeply imbalanced. Yeah, but I, what choice do we have? That's exactly the thing. He took that choice away from you so he could squander that deal whenever he wanted. No honor, that man. No honor. No honor. That's right. I hope someone... I hope someone knocks over his mojito. I hope that somebody puts a bullet in him. Well. And then I hope I'm around to not help him. Well. If it's, it's if it ain't reported, it didn't happen. That's right. I ain't a violent woman, but I'm trying to learn to be. What do you need to know? About being violent? You need someone to punch? Well, I would need more boxing lessons. I'm trying to learn from as many people as I can so I can... Is there a boxing ring down in Rhodes? I don't think so. When I was in Valentine learning from gold, we just fought in the pig star. All right, let's go to the pig pen. All right. To Valentine! I ho away! This is where that uh that document that Ames wrote up for me might come in handy. 
Oh, you know, yeah, that's right. You know, gotta make sure we have our paperwork from the court. Wouldn't want anyone to think we're, you know, breaking the, 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 the law or something. Oh my god, you're not gonna forget about that. <laughs> It's all you. I've, I've, I've heard the stories, and I've, I thought yep. it. I thought it went as far as, oh, make sure you don't use the wrong spoon for the soup. Make sure you're using the correct cutlery. How many forks did they have to line out for you for breakfast? Uh, four, four forks. That's ridiculous. Well, not really. There's one for your. Your, your uh, eggs, and then there's one for your bacon, and then there's one for your uh, your dessert. A fork's and a fork. There's one for your for transferring food to your plate because you're not supposed to eat directly from other plates. That's ridiculous. I... So I'm not surprised to hear about <laughs> de declaring intentions when people are raised that they yeah. gotta you gotta use a fork the, the, for the this. The whole conversation was as awkward as you can imagine it was. I imagine, and now you you had this. Uh, I imagine you had this conversation in the uh, correct room of the mansion, right? No, we had it in the middle of Valentine. Oh, that no, man, that simply will not do. You got to make sure you're in the study of the chateau. Actually, it would be called the calling room. <laughs> There's a oh Crashed. my. What the hell, Miss Wheeler? Ah. Oh my God, she's gone, <laughs> Miss Wheeler. Miss Wheeler! <laughs> oh my god! Henry! Henry, she's gone! <laughs> Henry! Are you like a dog? Can you do, you know, do you know how she smells? Can you find her? It's alright, boy. I'm here. It's alright. I'm not gonna leave you. It's all right, Henry. You see, you don't want to kick me. We have an, we have an understanding. <laughs> it's all right. You're all right, boy. I got you. I know. She can be a bit much sometimes, can't she? I know. And you gotta, you gotta be patient with some people. You know, these, these, uh, these, uh, high life ladies. They, they, uh, they got some, um, you know, they gotta wear corsets and things. So you gotta give them a bit of slack. You know, there's not enough blood going to their brain. <laughs> yeah, see, isn't he? she's always talking about you kicking people and that, but I, you, you're a good boy. See, you just, I don't know, she, what, she feeding, you, feeding you enough? Maybe she's got them rich folk organic carrots and you, you're craving a good old normal carrot straight from the earth some with actually a bit of flavor come on let's get you up by the by the house here Henry is my horse now Look at my horse. My horse is amazing. You're all right, boy. Henry! Henry, come back! Henry! Henry, no! Don't leave me out here! Henry, come back! Henry! Henry, what are you doing over here? Come on, move back to the house. She might come back. You're coming back here to have pets. 
You're gonna like it. <laughs> Brewery. Where are where even are we? What the fuck is this place? What I, that's what every house needs, is corner weeds. <laughs> when was the last time she gave you a nice brush, Henry? Yeah, there we go. Who's a good boy? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Been a while, hasn't it? She's too busy. She's doing too busy being a doctor to give poor old Henry some brushing. Don't worry, Henry. I'll give you all the brushing you need. Yeah. George should live in the brewery. Now nah, he's off the drink. Living in a brewery, he'll become a alcoholic. All the brushes for Henry. Brush, 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 brush. <laughs> Henry the horse. Do, 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 do. Henry. Do, 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 Henry the horse. Oh dear. Shell Bunny, who plays Cynthia Wheel, is just messaging me on Discord saying that, um. Hello. Apparently, there is some current issues with, um. People rejoining the server. Rip! That is concerning. It's all right. We'll just keep, we'll just keep spending time with um, we'll just keep spending time with Henry. We'll just keep hanging with our with our mate Henry. He's a good boy. The Adventures of Henry the Horse in color. I'm assuming this is like player owned. hunt nearby. I don't think I've, I don't think I've seen anything come by. Maybe a bird will pass over. I was like, what's that noise? It's a it's a horse. I was like, is that a bear? He's got some horses over there.
Aha! Damn you, Canada Goose! By the time I heard him, it was too late. I was not... I was not really paying attention there. I was listening out for sounds like that, but then heard the ho 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 ho. It just did not click. Hear more birds. Henry. Henry, Henry, Henry. Oh! Yo, Scrat! Canada Goose! Wait! Imagine if I got one of them. I am not a very good shot. I think Cynthia Wheel has done another runner. She just sometimes she just runs away like goodbye. Poor old, poor George. Poor old, poor old George. Old George. So where the bloody hell are ya? It's gonna, yeah, get to the, the Valentine pig pen. Teach her how to fight. Like Russell Crowe, mate. Fighting around the world. Bit of fisty cuffs in the, in the Valentine pig pen. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? You can change the shoulder, can't you? Of like where the, the gun's sitting. I don't remember what it is. Henry! How you going, mate? You going alright, mate? You going alright down there, mate? You alright, mate? You alright there, mate? Do do do. Hang on, mate. Oh, I'm. Oh. It's hard being a horse. It's really. It's really can be quite a thankless job. On account of me always having a long face. Yeah! Ugh. Henry, Henry, Henry. This is a, a Henry appreciation stream now. More brushes for Henry! Louis tongue. <laughs> Teeth! <laughs> I'm gonna write in her chat. Henry and I are bros now. 
<laughs> I would laugh so hard if she like brought up my stream just to see if we're still here. She just and she just sees this. Just a couple of boys brushing each other. <laughs> <laughs> the wind in his mane. <laughs> I love you, George. I love you too, Henry. Must be some serious issues going on. Like, how long has it been? How much longer do I have to be patting Henry for? <laughs> right, we're doing some more laps. Oh, my headset needs charging. I better plug it in. There's drug dealing going on. Sorry, not not currently my bloody problem. Not my bloody problem right now. What do we got here? Some dream catches? Hot in them? My God, that would be. The, the server is scheduled to restart in 15 minutes. Do we wait here for 15 minutes? Why can't that be five minutes? I don't know what else to be doing here. 15 minutes? That's 15 minutes of brushing Henry. I feel like we've already... To restart it now, God. <laughs> I... I've already- I feel like I've already been brushing Henry for 15 minutes. Can you sing me a song? Um... Ah, uh, let me think. Would you like to hear- would you like to hear the song associated with my character here? In the- in this kind- in this- on this server? Would you like to hear- doesn't have to be a good one. Let me let me sing you. So this became a bit of a meme on the server. Is that have you ever seen that video where it's like they've taken clips from The Empire Strikes Back and they've like done a bad lip reading as if they're singing a song about seagulls? It's like Luke Skywalker and Yoda and that in his hut on Dagobah, and it's as if they're singing about seagulls poking you on the coconut. If you haven't, check it out on YouTube. It's like seagulls stop it now. So. I don't know how it came about, but basically I, I made it up that um, the George Hughes had heard the dock workers in St. Denis singing that song as like a work song because um, there's seagulls by the water. Um, so I sang it in character and it became a bit of a thing where people would be like, like the Sheriff Wolf would be like, hey, partner, everybody sing us that seagulls song again and that. Um, you know... <laughs> He's my ho he came willingly to me, Shelby. So so yeah, here's the song. Here's the George Hughes version of Seagulls. Stop it now. Um They're best friends now, that's right. Henry and I have a bond. Um together. Rockin', rockin' and rollin'. Hold on, let me let me sing it so I'm into the world in case anyone rides past. 
rockin', rockin' and rollin'. Down to the beach I'm strollin', but the seagulls poke at my head. Not fun. I said seagulls. Hmm. Stop it now. Everyone told me not to stroll on that beach. Said seagulls gonna come. Hug me in the coconut. And they did. And they did. And they be going like, hoo ha, hoo hoo ha, I can't remember how many hoo ha's they do. Nothing I could do but yell when these birds attacked me. <laughs> when I tried to run, I fell. And then these kids start laughing. And then, hmm. Got hit in the neck with a hacky sack. Mm hmm. Um, and then I can't remember. <laughs> and, and then he like goes and then does more like, hoo ha, hoo hoo. It does all that again. And it's got like the like, gotta run, 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 jump. I can be a backpack while you run. Run, 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 jump, and stop. Put me down. Um, and then I can't remember the... I can't remember, like, the... The melody of the rest. But there's a whole bunch of other verses and choruses and all that crap, so... Um, so... So basically, that YouTube song is now accepted in on server as if it's a like a sea shanty that they sing at the dock in Saint Denis. Um, that's one of the memes of the server. <laughs> a tasteful rendition to be sure. Um, but yeah, the first time I did it, like all the other lawmen were just like, they were so, they were just gobsmacked. They could not believe. They're like, what is this? Where is this coming from? I'm like, it's a YouTube video. And so then, and then they always bring up, they're like, George, look out for the seagulls. They're going to poke you in the coconut. And I've been saving singing it in front of other players since the reset. Um, I have not done it in front of any other characters yet. I've been saving it. So y'all, so there you go, Cow Blaster. There's, um, there's my ridiculous vocal cover of the f bit of the song. Ten minutes still. Oh my God. Oh my God. Bruh. Ten minutes, man. Ten minutes. Fucking hell. That's so long, man. That's so long. Why can't it just why couldn't it be five minutes? Well, I suppose fifteen minutes gives more people like people could be um further away from towns and they could have you know a bunch of mining goods in their carts or animals so they need to quickly run and sell it I guess well yep we are um we are I guess I'll take Henry to the uh, oil field because Henry uh, Henry and George Henry and Hughes I should say Henry and Hughes are best friends now um, so George is going to invite uh, Henry to the next dance instead of Cynthia. And look, if Cynthia needs to be riding Henry that night for work, she's just going to have to just accept that Henry is going to be occupied. Um, that's, I don't make the rules. Also, Cowblaster, thank you for the follow. <laughs> Howdy, partner. Um, yeah, so next dance, the next you know, dance or formal event that George gets invited to. I'm inviting Henry. And, um... Yeah. No, I, I, I agree, Rando. I think... I think it's only suitable that I own Henry now. Now that he's just, you know... His owner, previous owner. We, we must we must clarify. Previous owner just straight up abandoned him. Um, I think it's, it's only... Only suitable. Also, Phoenix for Montana. Mont Montana. Thank you for the follow. I had a lot of trouble pronouncing it. Montana. I was about to say Montana. Montana. Thank you for the follow, partner. Thank you for the follow, partner. Howdy. How's it going? <laughs> you can't... It's hard not to go into an American accent when you got to say Montana. Like, California. Oregon. <laughs> Ah, uh, the old oil fields where we would bring Todd Woodman. 
before the reset. We could make, um, we could make some, um, like an oil angel. Ooh. I want him to fall backwards. There we go. A man has fallen into the river in Lego City. Build the helicopter and save him. Ugh. Ugh. The sound. <laughs> um, so we were we were gonna go to the Valentine pig pen with uh, Miss Wheeler, MT, so that she could further learn how to punch. Um but then her head popped out here in the country, and so I've been um I reluctantly have taken ownership of her horse Henry to take care of him um and now we are killing time until the server resets soon I'm coming back to fight you have to fight for your horse you have to fight for Henry you're going down not with Henry at my side I have the power of friendship I have something to fight for <laughs> <laughs> 10 minutes is such a long goddamn time like i'm like let's explore the oil field you reckon henry loves oil baths can we get can we make him lie down in the oil have an oil bath he's like c3po this oil bath is going to feel so good that's why you scry he's like c3po Bless the maker. All right, how do you... How do you make a horse lie down? There's, so there's something you can do. There's something you can do. I'm sure there's a command or something. Everyone told me not to come down to the oil field. Give Henry an oil bath. Uh, what is a uh, horse? It's an I don't know. There was, I swear there used to be a command on the server, like, a. Hey, I'm talking like ages ago. Yeah, I, I wanna, I, I wish, because you used to be able to do a command or something, which would make the horses, like, lie down on the ground. Like, as if they're resting. And I cannot remember how to do that. I don't know if you still can. I'm not 100% sure if you still can. Used to be a thing. All right, but we can we can take him for a ride through the through the oil field. Everyone told me not to walk on that beach. Henry. Henry Horse. Or if anyone's ever seen Father Ted. My lovely horse. I can't remember the rest of the words, that one. I want to shower you with sugar lumps. Something like that. That's my blood, not Henry's blood. Um... Yeah, 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 it was like horse sleep or something. Like, I remember, um, Iron Jaw. 
would would get his horse to do it a lot from memory. I've always been um I've always been um had the idea of if anyone's ever seen There Will Be Blood, that movie with the the oil guy played by Daniel Day-Lewis, I've always been tempted to make a character that looks just like him and and just have like a bunch of quotes from the movie ready to go and just just go and bug people about wanting to drill oil around the country and they're like okay like go and do it like i'm an oil man this is my son eli i drink your milkshake do i have a milkshake can you have a milkshake and i have a straw see and it goes across the room Drainage! I drink your milkshake! I drink it up! Stop bullying me, Daniel! Drainage! It's such a, it's an odd movie. It's a good movie, but it's... <laughs> it's wild. Some bits. Alright, we gotta re disconnect for a moment. Everyone told me not to walk on that beach. Said seagull's gonna come. Hold me in the coconut. And they did. And they did. Now it's stuck in my head. Now, look what you've made me do. Look what you've made me do. You've made me go and get that damn song stuck in my head. <coughs> and now I'm Michael Caine, or attempting to be Michael Caine. That's a rap, yeah, do do do. You're like, oh my god. They said that when the rapture would come that we would hear horns or something, but it all it was was a doo -doo -doo. <laughs> No, it's completely fine, Cow Blaster. I will definitely if it's still stuck in my head tomorrow, I'll just have to watch the video again. Cause it's it's a it's a it is a it's a fun video. It's a fun video. It's a good time. And then they made another one. They made another one. Excuse me. They made another um song based on bad lip reading of Star Wars scenes, uh, which is the um uh the other one. It's, uh, bushes of uh hiding in the bushes of love or something. And that one's that one's really catchy. That one is really catchy. I think some other people wanted me to make up that that was a uh, like a working song in Saint Denis or something as well, but I just feel like the lyrics are just <laughs> just a bit too out there. That I don't think you could justify it. Like the seagulls, eh, kinda. Kinda. But the the other one I think it's too it's too silly. It's too much. Too much of a good thing. Alright, let's try and let's see if we can get back in there. Maybe we can still find Miss Wheeler. <laughs> Teach her to fight. And then I'll look at wrapping up after that, depending on what's going on. The world spoke to me so clear. Every time I asked its name. But I know now and I know dearly. This world is not the same. Though you came to rescue me Still I died in Saint Denis I left it all behind once Built me a home of friends I watched you tear it down once 
and you tore it down again. But still I built that home to capture souls and they lived there on its walls. Though this last time that you tore it down was the first time it would fall. <clears throat> no worries, Cow Blaster. Um, a lot of people, they will, like, they'll lurk, but uh, people will sort of have the general rule, like, if you're watching a streamer while you play, um, and as long as you're not going to, you know, take any information you learn, that's all fine. But then it's like, what they would usually do is that if you find yourself coming into the same area as them, they would, um, you know, minimize the tab and that. So whatever works for you. But I appreciate, I appreciate the, you know, being mindful of metagame. It's very good of you. Because it's very important. Like any, any metagaming and any power gaming and that, it all has a negative impact and it, it can, it can ruin some really good things happening naturally. Which is the whole point of a roleplay server. It's just let things happen. So it's all you gotta do. Just follow the goddamn rules. God damn it. Alright, we back. <laughs> we lost Henry. Now where did I ride from? I'll go check. Where'd we come from? There, I think? Apple lemon smoothie. Zoom, zoom, zoom! Nope. Uh... Was it there? That rings a bell? I can't remember where we came from. <laughs> One would assume that she will head to the, um... She'll head to the, um... The Valentine pig pen. Would be my guess. Jesus Christ! Are you alright? But for some reason, Henry is oily and I slipped. What? He's oily? He's oily for some reason. I slipped up. Oh shit, how could that have happened? Oh, yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna need to give him a bath. Yeah, that'd be nice. Yeah, Henry. Henry's a real good horse. He, he, he's not, I don't know what he's been telling you, he ain't the nicest horse. Oh, he's told me a lot. He told me an awful lot. You know he likes being brushed? Yeah, I, I brush him like 20 times a day. Hmm, yeah, how many? He gets plenty brushing, like 20 times a day. To only 20? Hey, will you brush your horse more than that? Georgie don't, Georgie don't need brushing. Each horse has different needs, miss. Well, no wonder your horse smells. Maybe she likes to smell. Maybe she likes wearing pants. Don't tell your horse what to do. I'm not. That's why I don't brush her more. <laughs> this conversation's gone off track real quick. All right, where's the pig pen? It's this way. <laughs> He's all oily. Whoa, well, There's a cliff there, though. miss. Yeah, I realize. Sorry, he's slippery. Yeah, I don't know how that could have happened. <laughs> just off the cliff. Ah! The cliff just goes and goes and goes. That's right. Henry is our horse now. Um, we don't make the rules. These things just happen. Zoom, 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 zoom. Your horse is in my room. Now they're just showing off how fast they are. Ah! <laughs> 
Excuse me. Oops, snake. Is Henry all right? He's, he's just a little tired. He's a bit more aerodynamics. He's going to be faster than usual. Raid was good. Where are you going? Pig pens that away. Raid was good, Cam. Morning chaos. Changed. I'll be one second. Changing the fighting gear. Oh, you didn't get the boss down? But it was good, like. Good good prep anyway. Do, 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 do. I have one, but I uh, don't really use it lately. Um, just because I've just been mainly doing Red Dead for for a while. That I yeah, I've just sort of lost track of mine. But I I, I I've only ever I've only ever played WoW like super casually and not that much, so I don't understand the logs of that. I'm afraid. Um, I just it seems really cool. I've just never been able to. Um, I've never been able to stick with it. I don't know. MMOs, the only MMO I've really, like, sunk a decent amount of time into, but even, it, it is, isn't even that much, was, um, Star Wars The Old Republic, simply because it's Star Wars, and it would, um, had some connections to the Knights of the Old Republic game. Z. Miss, why are you wearing white? Because I'm going to kick your ass. Oh! Oh, so so there so there'll be no mud on that white shirt by the end of this. Is that right? That's exactly the point. All right. All right. Well, I'll see what you can do then. No. You, well, that ain't the point. You meant to also teach me, and like you meant to throw punches too. Yeah, I'm gonna see what you do first. I'll block. Get in sec to block them. Ah! You quick. You got your arms up. Come on, you gotta follow it through. Oh, shit. Oh. Right, oh. Okay, alright. Okay, right. Okay, alright. That's good. You okay? You broke my, my impenetrable defense. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna. What are you doing backing away? Well, Mr. Gold said I always need to keep moving, and I keep forgetting. And to do that. don't forget to block. Oh, fuck! Easy. Keep. Ow. Lady, what have I told you? 
I think she might have this. Oh! Do you yell? No, fuck! <laughs> you yelled? Uh. Oh, God. You need some medical assistance, Mr. Hughes? Ah. Uh. Does anyone have a bucket of clean water? <coughs> I did it. Whew, now I got a head rush. I need a, I need a bucket of water and a I, cigarette. I need to rest for a second. <laughs> Yo, Lupa. There you go. Oh, now it's raining. God. Oh, God. Blah, blah, blah. No, pig, go away! Oh, come on now. Get out of here. Go. We'll be baking later. Oh my god. Anyway, so Mr. Gold taught me how to fight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, look. You you're quick. I'll give you that. Impressive. Thanks. Bit bit hard to know when to Go on the offensive when you're defensive, when it's quick in succession like that. So well done. Oh, I, I need to, to learn my that myself. Well, Dolores is going to teach all of us yeah, at one point. I'm just trying to yeah. get ahead of the lessons. I feel a little left out now. Do you want to fight, William? Uh. It only. She. It's fight. It only hurts uh... for a little bit. I, I think I, I'm gonna I'm gonna go under cover and have have a cigarette to clear my head. Uh, uh, try not to bother Miss uh, Miss uh, uh, Dolores. You're right, George. I ain't hurt you that much. I'm I'm just going up under where it's dry and have a cigarette. And I'll be all right. All right. I'm, I'm sorry if I hate you. No, bad. it's fine. I don't know if this is someone's house, but it will do. <coughs> Zoe and Terrence. Who's gonna win now? Who the fuck is this? How you doing? <laughs> Come here often? <laughs> huh? Oh, bye. Goodbye! I'm just gonna leave, okay? I was I think I see a bit of mud on the on the white. You shut your face or I'll come for you again. Okay. Say <laughs> 
Hey, hey, come on now. Nothing below the belt. Get out of the way, pig. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't even know how to tell, but my head is not happy. Well done. <laughs> well done. I, I think you softened her up for me, Mr. Hughes. Uh, I hope so. Now, now that means y'all need to fight each other. Oh. My head's still pounding. I think I need a bath. Oh. I'm cold. I, Why not get a little bit dirtier before you <laughs> get in the bath then? Fight each oddly, other. Oddly enough, I'm actually cleaner than I was. Yeah, no, I, I would say, how, how much mud do you think's on her white top? Uh, about 20%. Yeah, that's at least, that's at least I can't get a bit up. more than 0%. Oh, I'm good. There yeah, you, go. you two should fight each other, <laughs> you know. Let me have a bath, though, because I'm about to get sick. Oh, no, I got sick. Uh, oh, no. Oh, uh, Hank, did you need a herbal oh, remedy? Oh, no. What do we do? I need uh, a herbal uh, remedy. It's right. I, I got her. I don't know if I'm still, I don't know if I'm sick. I think I'm just, maybe have a concussion. Oh. What's your train ticket? Uh. Cynthia? I have yeah, 25. don't have any. Sorry, I got a headache, so my, my pockets are hard to go through. I missed the- Oh no, I missed the oh, trough! No. Yeah, take that. I, I won't even put in a report for this one. Oh dear. Uh, I need to have a bath before I can take it, apparently. I will be oh, yeah. back. And then you'll have to fight to make me feel better, alright? Is, all right. is that as fast as you can, she can currently walk? Yeah, when you get sick, it makes you lethargic. Right, we, be, we better walk with her, because uh, that's... In Valentine, yeah. someone will think, that's a payday. <laughs> the walk of shame. Ugh. Ugh, oh, this doesn't feel glamorous at all. I wouldn't call it a walk of shame, per se. I'm being followed by at least one person who beat me, so... Maybe a walk of pain? Yeah, that's right. I... Look, at least I beat Mr. Hughes, you know. Oh, and now I'm real hungry, too. Hang on. I will say it is nice to see you again, Mr. Hughes. Oh, thank you, William. It's good to be back. But, uh, yeah, I'm taking a break from the law department. I'm on a... Standard leave of absence, so I'm just gonna be. Yeah, I'm a whole chicken. Get, getting around, yeah, seeing the world. Yeah, hope you've been well. I, I heard about your little incident with uh, uh, Mr. Calder. Yeah, uh, well, that's kind of why we need to learn how to fight as doctors, you know. Very, very much so. Yeah. And I, I, I was actually very sad to hear that, and I was kind of annoyed that, of course, it happened while I wasn't here, because if I'd been around there. We would have been having more than words, I'll tell you that much. I'm annoyed on many different accounts. Because of that bastard, now I've got swine flu because I feel the need to fight people. No one threatens a damn doctor. Let alone two of them. Oh! Uh... Come on, you're nearly there! Oh, oh she's alright. 
Don't take too long in there. I need one as well. You, I'll take as long as I like. I won. Save some warm water. No, you didn't. Dear, oh dear. I'm wearing easy on her, kinda. Well, I tried to, and then she just got out of control. Too quick. You can always go for a best two out of three. I guess. Oh, what the hell was that? There's been quite a few shots today. We had a mass casualty incident earlier. A what? We had like 12 people all get shot in the same road. Ah, oh, Jesus. Where was this? And, uh, not too long before the storm blew through, Mr. Actually. Hughes, go have a bath, you smell. Oh. <laughs> like a loser. Wow. Wow. Hey, wow. I, I still be him. Wow. Look at that. Oh, I want to pick that hat up. I don't think I can. <laughs> nice and clean. Scrub a dub dub. Yeah, uh, frontier. Do, 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 Twen you can get one for $20. I'll give you five. Oh, he tried to kick me. I'll, I'll give you some money, sir. I got 30 and 60 on me right now. What, what's your train ticket, Addy? Uh, let me go get my own bath. Uh, 56. So I've got about 13 on me. Mm -hmm. Fucking almost 56. My head hurts. <laughs> Oh, thank you so, so much. Um, uh, you, uh, that should help can you I, out. uh, send you something? Nope, nope, we're good. You, oh, you just get your horse. She is very much all about paying people back, so you just... No, you yes. don't think you can pay me back, just because I slipped $100 in your pocket. You... And then $50 the other day, and with $150... You may as well girl. turn into your life, go pay me back. No, well, we're so, square. I paid you enough. Yeah, you... So, do you want... I've I got something for no, you. you and, no, 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 sir. Right. You keep everything you need. I'm a doctor. I get a steady income. You do what you do. And I don't as a lawman? Well, you're, you're going to be on your sabbatical for a few weeks, did you say? A what? A sabbatical? A leave of absence. That's what that is, a sabbatical. Is it? Yeah. That's, that's, a, that's a bit. That's a that's a word and a half. S a b b a t i c a l. A, a bathical, right? Got it. Sabbatical. Hmm. Yeah. Right. Now you two gonna fight and make me feel better? <laughs> my my head is literally still pounding. Yeah, so is mine. It ain't stopping me fight. Do you want a William? Uh, I suppose we must. Yep. I just might just go away my head. No, no, no offense, Actually, but I hope George fights second. William and beats William, because then it'll be like everyone wins one once. My head no. really hurts is all. I, I have something for that, actually. Well, save it for after. I'll just endure it for now. I, I kind of used it on myself as well, so it wouldn't be fair. Oh, if you're sure. Did, did you take performance and handsome stuff? No, Thank I you. ate some marshmallows. Oh, that's performance enhancing. That sugar will give you a sugar rush to make you fight better. Cotton, have some cotton candy Mr. Hughes can have. If, if that'll oh, get rid of this candy. headache. It'll help. Anything with sugar tends to help out with something like that. So we just don't have too much. All right. All right. Doctor's orders. There you go. Thank you. Let's see what that does for you. Oh, yummy. Yeah, at least makes me think about something else rather than the constant pain. All right. How'd that, how'd that help you? Yeah, look, it's fine. 
I appreciate it, William. All right. No, you can just leave him there. He shouldn't run too far. Then you can you can whistle to bring him back. All right. Let's get this show on the road. Just go easy on my head. Uh, I, I should be asking you that. Hey. Actually, mm, no, nah, it's fine. Would you like to throw the first punch? Oh, let's just uh, three, two, one. Let's go. Always forget the controls. Like, is there something more I can be doing with the controls? But it's like, do I just mash the button and sometimes block? Back. Jeez. <laughs> You're right. No. Ow, my ribs. You need me to check him? Please don't poke my ribs. Well, in medical fit terms, we call that palpating, not poking. Palpa what? Palpating is to touch in a clinical setting. P a p a l p a t i n g. Palpable. Or P A L P A T E, palpate. I think, I think you mean palpable. That's no, that's not the same thing, George. Pupation. Uh, same root word, I guess. That, don't side with him. I'm supposed to sound smart here. Pineapple. Uh. Oh. oh no, he's fine. Oh, I think. I how did. how in the hell did I win twice? I. I don't know. Considering you should have just thrown punches back at Cal the other day. Yeah, I think, uh, I think you're ready I, I, for I him. If you fought back, you would have won. I, I know. I'm, uh, well, maybe I would have beaten him, but then his friends probably would have shot us. Uh, yeah, but... You're ready yeah, for next time. I'm going to go up that bath. Oh. Uh, the main thing is that two uh, doctors... Sorry, Hughes. No, it's, it's fine. The main thing is that two doctors are now... More ready fighting. I think Mr. Hughes has realized how hardcore we are today because we were racing around the county on super speed on our horses and mm. beating the crap out of him. Hey. The doctors are uh, stronger than you think, I guess. I thought you were supposed to be just putting the blood back in. I, I do appreciate well, the lesson. Uh, yeah. It's fine. The main thing is next time you get the cow done or... A taste of his own medicine. Well, if he messes with me, I guess I can. Oh, I want to just walk up ah. to him. And... Oh, George! Oh. I didn't see the counter. Oh. oh! Oh, is he sick? No, he's he's injured. That's it. He's oh. Oh. George, you getting mud on that sofa? Oh. George, getting mud on the floor. Oh. The floor's getting on me. Alright. Where am I going? Hey. This ain't a bath. This ain't a bath. Ow!
Oh my god. I'm just getting mud everywhere. Another bath. Another day, another bath. Scrub a dub dub. Okay. Would you like a nice tea, Mr. Hughes? A tea? <clears throat> nice Earl Grey. Sure. <coughs> they just can't feed me. Man, she she went to the water. pharmacy to get herself a bandage. Ooh. Oh, do be aware. Um, hopefully, Miss Dolores is restocking all of our pharmacies. We had to take all the stock out. Right. But she should be putting it back in. Yeah, they, they ain't nothing in there right now. It, it'll be restocked in the morning, I think, but we're on our own for a bit. Yeah. No, she was a little overrun. She was over it, I know. But how, how many uh, morphine do you have on you in case, you know, shit goes south? I got nine. Okay, good. I think I have eight or seven. We should be all right then. Yeah, I haven't had more than 11 people go down on one night, so. Well, I've just treated eight today jesus well oh hey no is I, that miss erica over there 12. yeah 12. mr who uh i can't remember all these people's names oh, someone's hard at work doing an honest labor uh, it's it's not my idea there? No, was, oh. I, I fought Mr. Hughes here and I won, and then I fought William and I lost, and then William beat Mr. Hughes as well. So William is overall the champion tonight. So is this what Don't doctors do when they're off duty? I'm trying to learn how to do self-defense. Ah! Oh. I, I did get my face pummeled the other day, so it's important. Yes, I understand. Uh, uh, have you met I... Mr. Hughes? Uh, no, I have not. How this is it? Mr. Hughes. He's one of the West Sheriffs at the moment, and this is er Dr. Eric. He's from uh, he's from Germany. Well, one of the sheriffs. Uh, I'm I'm technically on a leave of absence, but yes, I technically well, I am currently an acting sheriff. Yeah. Well, um, I would like to report some stolen weaponry. Well, you'd probably best chasing up uh one of the deputies, Sledge or Woodman, or the other acting sheriff, Harkness, because it may be a while till I get in and write some paperwork yeah mr hughes just came back from boston so he's been out of the loop and he's on oh. he's on sabbatical so then i will not worry you with it so enjoy your rest and enjoy your leave ah uh, it can only get better from here <laughs> ah. Do dr eric here is a, a hopefully a prospective medical recruit he's already accredited in germany yeah yeah oh just, uh, uh wunderbar ah indeed it is very very wunderbar i'm waiting uh, to hear a response from my application from uh, uh, Mr. Doolittle. And uh, perhaps should be a quick jump from uh, recruit to uh, official recognized doctor, given my previous experience. Oh. Yeah, at, at, at least uh, a week for most people, so <laughs> it shouldn't take too long. Yes, hopefully. Hopefully it should not. <sighs> In fact, whilst you're here, have you um, seen the minister or any of the Creed family around? Uh, they were around here earlier, but there was quite the shootout, so I don't think they're sticking around. Oh! Uh, yeah. I I'm gonna attend that bear attack. Oh, there there's actually two... Do Dolores is assigned to one of them. I'm taking the other one. Okay. All right. Then, uh... And you just let me know if you need any assistance. Yep. Wait, what's she doing? Still... What are you doing? Put some set bear attack, you wanna come work? with? Oh, shit. I wouldn't be doing my job if I didn't. Well, you got your gun? Do keep her safe. There is Put a some self defense skins. As to long as I don't you. have to punch it, I'm fine. Well, I think you. I think you definitely got the chops to, for fun. I'm, I'm getting there. I'm just surprised at that. You know, we said he was a hundred pound soaking wet bean pole. <laughs> Both of us. Yeah. I, 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 as, uh, 
I guess getting that knocked around the other day is maybe switch something on in his head and now he's ready for anything more like that? Because, yeah, he was... He was doing really well. Um, yeah, I felt that. Yeah, that it certainly was something. Maybe it just unlocked something primal in him and he just unleashed. I don't know. That was something Yeah! Else. But I did... You know, I've knocked out you, and I've knocked out uh, Mr. Gold, and I've knocked out Dexter, so bliss grows. Yeah, you're very quick, and then, and then I was about, I was literally, partway through it, I was literally about to say, you know, now, you know, try and come at from another angle, and then boom, there it was, in my, into my ribs, so good, good work. I appreciate that, and I like that all of it was above board, because of that document I have. I'm like, <laughs> and just less tackling. You know, if that, that was not on purpose, I, that was I slipped. I imagine so. Just if that was an actual professional boxing competition, you might find yourself being disqualified. But yeah. Well, I mean, it's less about boxing and more about just fighting, right, and getting dirty, and just taking people down no matter the way they they attack me. Yeah, no, you know, yeah, out on the street, out in the wilds, you know, whatever you got to do to survive. But yeah, just if there was, a, if you, if you find yourself entering a tournament or something, just keep that in mind. Yeah, I need to also learn how to defend myself against somebody trying to strangle me, which is oddly specific, but I think I need to learn that now. So. No, well, yeah, that's not, that also is very much under the belt. That's not okay. Where's, where was his bear attack? Uh, it is, I think it's Great Plains, or it might be pointing at the Manzanita Post. I set my compass. Didn't quit check Look, if you think we've got time to swing by the bank, I can grab my my rifle. But if we don't have time, I can make do with my navy revolver. Uh, I think the navy revolver will do fine. I've done. I've been shooting bears with that all week. All right. Oh, he wants to go this way. All right. Wait, if I got one here. Hang on a minute. You're fine. I'm just I'm just here for the ride and just trying not to think about my head. I don't have other ammo, do I? Gonna gonna shoot a Hold bear. On. Yeah, we're going to the Aurora Basin, same place where I found the campsite. I just need to put my rifle off. Okay. I don't know, Dub. I because I've eaten food, I've had some drink. I think it might just take time, or I got to get bandages or something, or have medicine. I gotta say, you're really fine in your feet, Miss. You think so? I. You know, you already had your head on screwed on right when I when I met you and we went hunting, but now to see you, literally. Riding out, out to a bear attack, uh, dressed in what you, I guess, your fighting gear with a rifle in hand. It's, it's impressive. Well, I had a few days where I defended myself. You know, no use was here to bail me out. So, a oh, lot can happen in a few days. I don't think you'd really need my help much. Yeah. It was a, it's been a rough time, and I just feel like I've had to rapidly get better. No, I, yeah, that was, it was a, that was a tough telegram to read, and then you mentioned that you were feeling really anxious, and you, you, you're steering clear, like, down in Armadillo Way and everything, and then you had that other tag, like, that's, that's, that's not. And then at some point, I just gave up writing to you, because I was like, I can't write these miserable telegrams anymore. We've taught, you can... Write me all the miserable no, telegrams I mean, you want. I come back to a whole stack of telegrams and, you know, have to read all that. It'd be no different than if you would tell me in person. Yeah, I think it's different. Tone is everything. You know, tell, when you're there, you can sort of assure somebody that you're fine. I guess. It's a, uh, yeah, it's a lot. I don't know. I just, 
I was just also getting to a point where I was drinking myself to sleep every night. So I was forgetting to send telegrams because I was just. Oh, out don't of it. do that. Oh, yeah, it's fine. It's with tequila down at the armadillo. It's very nice. Just one before you go to bed, right? Well. Yeah, sure, one. Look, I ain't telling you what to do, but just. You know, just be careful. That's maybe have a cigarette instead. I'm fine, but maybe this is the self-destructive thing that William was talking about being worried about me for. You get you get more on a path of self-destruction. We'll be having words, miss. No, I'm fine. I'm still alive. I've kept myself alive. <laughs> I'm, you know, making a little bit of money. I'm helping people out. Getting close on this bear? No, we're a little bit away yet, and Henry's kind of exhausted. All right, take your time. We can't, can't help him if we mm -hmm. wreck ourselves on the way there. So Aurora Basin is uh, in the forest in tall trees, and then next to it there's a campsite that people have set up, and there's been a few of them living there. And we've had multiple callouts there for animal attacks, so I think they should get up and move. And at one point, one of them also got shot by a native, so in the in the neck with an arrow. Well, they, Which they, also, by the way, I also got shot in the neck, but with an arrow. Yeah, you mentioned what the hell happened there? Oh, uh, I was hunting a legendary uh, boar, and uh, my friend Zelda from Armadillo had drawn her bow and then turned around and shot me when she went to talk to me. Oh my god. Yeah. And oh Joseph my did the god. Same thing to William the day before, so it was very embarrassing for everyone. Did you have your land on your hip like you usually do? We were standing right next to each other. That was a problem. We were too close. Hopefully Miss Zelda's learned. No, she's it was fine. Something. It was, it was a mistake. It happened. Right. Mm-hmm. Well, this group over here, they probably accidentally camped on, you know, land. Well, you know, it all is, you know, extra sacred land to the Native Americans. It's probably good, good idea they move. Or at least if they're going to camp where the bears live, keep someone on watch at all times. Yeah, you're telling me. We've already attended two bear calls out here today. Yeah, maybe they sh maybe they get the hint this time. Is that it over there? The lot? Nope, that ain't it. Oh God. We're going further into tall trees. That's I, a different camp. I can hear wolves. I'm keeping an eye out. That definitely sound like howling nearby. Feel like we're gonna get killed by a bear. Two horses, all right. No riders. All right, we're coming around this lake now, which is where it should be. All right. Yep. Dolores is here. This man actually had uh, arrows sticking out of him. Louisa. It was a call for a bear yes, attack. Was, how are you? Ah. That, that's I'm a bit confused. I didn't uh, see as well. no bear. And then he didn't see a bear either. So that's alright. Yeah, it might have been was... a false call. There, I have been natives shooting people at uh, this exact campsite before. Oh, sure. Okay, so there was yeah five five arrows sticking out of him. Five arrows. All right. Yeah. Well, which way you, were they uh... sticking out of him? Oh, they were just like straight up in his chest there. His yeah, chest, so maybe chest, from yeah, over here. I'll go check the perimeter. Chest is done. <laughs> Did you chance run over with Henry? <laughs> Henry's mine!
No, is that an actual ca- is that an actual character? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, that meme is out of control. I'm almost expecting a bear to just come running out of somewhere. I think they've set up camp right next to a Native American camp. Are you insane? It's just asking for trouble. <laughs> well, I hope they don't shoot us with arrows. You've built your camp in their backyard. This is my camp, boy. Help! Get out of my Luisa! camp. Luisa! Cynthia, help! Help! What the fuck is that? Help! Help, I've been tied up by the lake! Help! Help! Just kidding. Henry! Henry! Henry, can you hear me, boy? This is my game. Who the fuck was that? Oh, that actually gave me a little bit of scare as well. Here I am talking shit. And it's like, Rah! Help! 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 I'm by the lake! Help, I'm tied up by the lake! Henry! <coughs> Louisa! Cynthia! Help! God damn it, why can't you hear me? Help! Help! I can see him. Help! Help me! Help! <gasps> Help! <laughs> Help me! Help! Help! I'm tied up by the lake! Please, my li don't leave without- Help! I'm by the lake! Help! I'm tied up! Help! 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 Please, God, help me! I'm by the lake! Over here! Down here! By the- By the fucking lake! I'm down by the fucking lake! Oh, no! Not of the- Over here! I'm over here! I'm by the lake! Help! Help me! Cynthia! Cynthia, I'm down here! By the lake, please! What the hell? There's a man! The man tied me up and he ran off yelling that this is his camp! That might be the fellow who shot our patient. Yeah, he he was naked and he ran down and tackled me and tied me up and left me for dead! Did he take anything of yours? You are right? No, he just tackled me, tied me up, and ran off. Louisa, there's a naked man van running around. He had George tied up. He, ca he came out of nowhere. He tackled me, tied me up, and he's like, this, he's like, this is my camp. And then he ran off. Uh, uh, what the? What the hell? I have yeah, just, just down here. So, I'm so confused about the whole situation. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, friend. By the fucking lake. Lapis doesn't like this area. He's very scared. Oh, but, oh, yeah, I'm scared. The guy could be behind any of these trees. Uh, maybe we should leave. There was there was another man when I showed up. Um, was he naked? 
No, he had his clothes on. Well, this guy, he was. I think he was. I think he was naked. Oh, is that a snake? Got that he didn't look out. like a Native American, yeah, though. He yeah. looked like like his. Maybe. What the hell? Well, I have a bullet for him if he comes close again. Are you feeling okay? He didn't hurt you. Is that him? That's not it. Is that, is that no, that's our patient. That's fine. Okay. Get me the hell out of here. It's yeah. all I needed after getting. My head already hurts. Then I'm lying in the dirt. Oh, we need to go this way. I didn't even hear him coming up behind me. He ran no. over this way, so keep your eyes peeled. I thought it was weird that we couldn't see you. Wait, who's that? Lucky I told you. Hello? Put down the gun, George. I'm on edge. Howdy. What's going on in my camp? There's a naked man running around tying people up. You be careful. Oh, not again. <laughs> my God. He's really mean. Who's <laughs> running around my camp? Not again. <laughs> I can't, so they've had that problem before. Yeah, we've been to, out to the camp about three times now. Probably just this same naked man every time. Once it was a bear, but maybe it was a bear they mistook, like a man they mistook for a bear. Was he hairy? I didn't really get a good look. It, it happened so fast. Like, you have no idea. He just came out of fucking nowhere. I didn't even have time. Mm -hmm. I didn't have time to fight back. Next thing I know, he had ropes around me. If I didn't tell you as I was going to check the perimeter, I, he could have got, well, gotten over. Well, I always thought it was strange because even before when you were checking the perimeter, you still came back and checked on us every, like, you know, once in a while. And then I thought, well, nice George ain't even in eyesight, which is kind of strange. I thought you were going to ride off. I'm no. yelling out, by the lake! By the lake, and then you almost could not hear you. You were starting to head yeah. up towards the mountain. I'm thinking, I'm yelling out like, no, no way. That was the last time I saw you. You were heading that direction. Oh, thank God. I'm so glad you were paying attention. Thinking, I'm thinking to myself, not like I mean, this. I, I just stumbled upon you. I didn't actually see where you went. Oh, I need water. My throat's real dry from all that yelling. You've had a certainly had a day, haven't you? Yeah, I have. Yeah, I have. It's been a week. Yeah, well, welcome oh. back to county. This is what it's How like. are you, Louisa? Oh, confused. What are you confused about? A lot, a lot of things. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. Well, I mean, that, that man, he said there was attacked by a bear, but then he had arrows in him. And then, just, it's been a confusing, uh, so many gentlemen in my life. I don't know what I'd want to do. Are they taking you to court? No. Well, well that's that's what they've done wrong. Court. They haven't taken you to court. Uh, I like, uh, Cynthia, I do like that idea of, uh, you know, not actually. <laughs> yeah, you know what I any mean? Of. I also like, I like the idea of putting a rat on the governor's desk. The governor? Well, I got a steak. Yeah. what the governor do? Many I can put things. the snake here instead. Yeah, the snake. I think the snake is a good Wait. message. Wait, what, what did he do to you? Oh, well, look, I, I went and had a chat to him in his office, and we had a nice little chat discussion. Yeah. And then... <laughs> Sorry. You're right. Oh, ah! Did we go the wrong way? No, we're fine. It's just... I'm trying to get used to not using my compass so much. Uh, the other doctor was teaching me. Oh! It's fine. Yeah, so we had a nice chat. Uh, there was a couple of sticky beaks, you know, looking through the window at the time. Yeah. Uh, and, like his PAs and a few other rubber neckers. But um, then uh, after that, there was a, a, a notice in the newsletter about a uh, about a speed a, date the governor speed dating with the governor. Wait, and what? When? We, could, we couldn't Yesterday. tell if it was like a what? So then speed we'll dating get... with the governor or just posted by the governor. So they are they're organizing speed dating the governor. While he's this... entertaining the feelings of this lovely lady. But there's okay. no sign. Yeah, but he there's no me, sign of the sheriff folk. Are you kidding me? He, he, yeah. he, gave, 
he gave me uh, he gave me marshmallows and a, a, a I think it was a mojito. Uh, oh God! And I gave him a box of cookies to have at his desk. So uh, uh, that's why I'm confused because I'm like, well, did, oh. did he enjoy my company or not? You know? But he hasn't taken it to court. If he doesn't intend to really, if he's just looking for someone to have a different kind of conversation with every now and then, that's or take someone to an event, I, I don't mind that. You know, it doesn't have to be an official label or anything on it. I, but you know, communication would be nice. That's right. Communication is the bare minimum that you deserve. You know what you could do to sort of level the playing field. Yeah. You should uh, you should get him talking about something really important to him, right? Like, yeah. you know, maybe like something he regrets or feels shameful about. You know, something that something that really hits oh, him where he lives. Start. And then as soon as he's sort of getting into it, run away. That oh. was different. That was different. Mm-hmm. Uh oh. Okay. Look, I think Louisa should focus on having friends at this point. And these gentlemen who keep riding around are being silly. Oh, yeah. Ain't worth entertaining. Mr. Mr. Whitman's building me on the nose at the moment. Oh, that's Dr. sweet. Well, that's what I thought, but some people are like, that's weird. And so then uh, that's why I'm confused about that. And then. Do you then see other people booping others on the nose? Louisa booped me on the nose because she had to explain to me what that was. Yeah, but do you see everybody else in everyday life booping each other on the nose? No, because it's your thing. It's special. Oh yeah. It's personal. Yeah, he don't. He. I've never seen him boop anyone else's nose. You ever think of it like that? Okay. That's a new light. Yeah. Well, that it does shed some light on things that I hadn't yet. Maybe he's tried to talk to people in the past and that. Oh shit. The hell was that? That was luck. Damn, that rattlesnake. Main Street? You sound like it. All right. We'll take a quick sticky beat, but we won't go too far. Just down to that intersection there. Miss Wheeler, get down. I, don't, I, I know you're fine, but stay behind me, all right? Just going to take a look. Let's take a little sticky beat, and then we'll come back. Hello? Hello? Hey! Sorry, sorry. Watch it! Watch where you're throwing that thing! <laughs> Y'all are out? We heard a lot of shooting around here. Yeah, I was trying to figure that out as well. It sounded like it was in the maybe the main street or the front street. Yeah, I don't know. That's a dead man on the road. Everything okay? Yeah, I think so. Cynthia, Everything gonna, seems fun. You're gonna give me a goddamn heart attack walking what, off like why? that. Why? Going head first into there. Oh, uh, but this is normal in Blackwater. You hear the shooting and you just have to, you have to approach it cool headed and, you know, acting like you're meant to be here. Otherwise, people might shoot you if you're acting suspicious. Yeah, but if someone's gonna get shot coming around the corner spooking one of these assholes, it should be me. No, that ain't how it works. 
Yeah. The idea is that nobody gets shot. Oh. Well, we, better, we better get back to your horse. I sent him to the stables. I was going to actually get some shut eye and the doctor's off. It is getting a bit late. It is. And you look tired. You're like worn uh, out. This is because of all the fighting. Yeah. F fighting? What, I, what have you I, been doing? I beat Mr. Hughes in a in a fighting match in the pig star, you, and then William beat what? both of us, by the way. Yeah, my, my head hurts. Oh, no. Well, good on William. Uh, and and you, Cynthia, for, you know, getting your getting in there. I'm and trying Mr. my best Hughes to learn. Too. Jump and I have that legal document that allows me to beat Mr. Hughes up whenever I want. <laughs> yeah, it's all legal through the court system. Oh, that's good. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> with my leave of absence, I don't know. Usually I just go crash in the sheriff's department. I might have to rent a room at the hotel. You're you're on a leave of absence at the moment? Yeah, I need to do some soul searching. Oh, sure. So, I don't know how long that's, that's going to take, but I'm going to be... Might try and do some work experience with the trains. Go do some hiking, go do some hunting, explore the world, just try and get my feet back on the ground and remember what... Well, in my early days oh, in Blackwater, really I good. used to find a hay bale to crash on inside the stable. Hay bale? I'll just go rent a I room. All right, well, yeah, I had no money back then, so there's a difference, I guess. Oh, actually, I need to send a couple of telegrams. All right, well, you two ladies are okay now? Yeah, I'm good. I'm, I'm going to sure go lock good. myself in the doctor's office. All right. Well, I'll see you. I'll see you around. Right. It was Take good care. seeing you again. Good to see you. You stay right. safe now. No okay, promises. You too. Good night, Cam. Have a good one. Oh, yeah. I just need a moment to <laughs> be my You're a cowboy so. now. Sleep on the boat dock like me. Just use the bench seat as cover. So, yeah. Good for the spine, right? Please, no funny business. I just want to send some telegrams and go to bed. Please. Please just leave me the fuck alone. <laughs> oh no. Don't you fucking dare. I will fucking... I will... I will fucking drop you, mate. I will fucking... I will not hesitate, mate. Oh god. You fucking think about it. I will destroy you. <laughs> Fuck you, door. On. What are you looking at? Oh, Master Moonshot? Excuse me? What do you want? Oh, Master Moonshot? No, I do not. Bad. Sorry, I'm just not in the mood for today. What the? <laughs> you want to bash No! Leave me alone! <laughs> Fuck off! Piss off! <laughs> Be gone! <laughs> All right, let's um, let's get an email. Uh, no, I was about to say, let's send an email. So we've got Edward. Are you sure? Oh my god! Hey. <laughs> I can I can just pass it through you. Where the fuck is he? He's 
from... <laughs> Show it, try not to die. This guy's trying to sell me moonshine. He won't let me do telegrams. Oh my god. Oh, I don't like this. Oh! You following me? Nope. What do you want? You want bash your moonshine? <laughs> You've already asked me. I don't want any goddamn moonshine. I, I do. I do a deal. Five bucks. I sell four of them. I do not want. I I do not feel like any moonshine. Oh, okay, okay. I understand. You don't want the moonshine. I'm so just not today, okay? All right, thank okay. you. The fucking prem. The fucking prem. Ah! Oh, it's unsettling. Ah! Oh, ah! Oh, it's just it's just following me around. Oh, it's really unsettling. Good day, Mr. Jones. <laughs> you can see him. <laughs> My name is George Hughes. I am currently on a leave of absence from the West <laughs> Department and and was hoping what about four dollars <laughs> hoping to potentially do some work maybe with a train yard hey <laughs> For, for a couple of weeks to get out there see the world if yeah, you have bass. any positions available please let me know my regards George Hughes first ID six All right. Where the fuck did he go? You want a four dollars? <laughs> no. <laughs> to a batch of moon is moonshine le is moonshine legal? I can't remember. No! Oh fuck! I can't. I couldn't even remember that. I have a feeling. I've still got the. I've still got the horse from the race that time. I investigated a forest fire last night and found that guy. <laughs> What's he starting forest fires or something? Yeah, I've still got the horse from the the race. They said they were going to come and collect them. But I could be riding around on Twilight, like, really fast. Are we allowed to keep it after all? Oh, now nah, Mushan still lets off smoke. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that guy's played by Prem. And then, yeah, the cheese guy, that's played by, um... Uh, Dick Dome. I think. I think. Um... Could be riding around on this horse this whole time. I think I think they're gonna take it at some time. No worries, Shelby. Very a very funny night. Have a oh, have a wonderful sleep. <coughs> I'll be wrapping up soon. <coughs> I got work tomorrow. Oh, <coughs> uh, um, I think. I'll change him. 
May as well. Oh, time flies by. Oh. So yeah, I don't know. I might take it easy with Hughes over the next couple of weeks. Um, just, just take it easy from Lord. Try some other stuff. Um, especially three dollars for two. Where? Where? What? I, I don't want any moonshine. I do. I don't. I'm not interested. It's pretty good moonshine. I tell you, it's only the best. I, I'm sure it is. I just you, you should probably go and find people that actually want to buy it, though. Well, I found you, didn't I? Yeah, but I, I'm off. I'm off alcohol. This ain't alcohol. What's what's in it then? Um, it is like uh, fermented uh, roots. I. I don't know what the hell that is. It, it doesn't sound like yeah, a normal it's from drink. The earth. Yeah, God given earth. Well, uh, what's it do to you if you have some of it? If you have too much it of it? It makes you smarter, handsomer. Oh. Hell, I'm 96 years old. <laughs> I, 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 I just, I got a feeling it'd be too much like alcohol, and I'm, I need to steer clear of drinks like that. Mm -hmm. I'm just on, you know, apple lemon smoothies and uh, what else am I drinking? Alright, I tell you what, two dollars for two of them. No, like, I'm only really interested in stuff like orange juice, cowboy cocoa, that sort of thing at the moment. Yeah, yeah, you could definitely put orange juice with this stuff. <laughs> I, nah, again, sorry, I just, I'm not interested. Yeah, you know how hard it is to get this stuff, man. Look, know. there's there's like three people out there. Yeah, they don't if want ask, it. Well, go ask them again. All right. I, yeah, I probably should. Huh? I'm I'm trying to go to sleep. I don't moonshine. I'm probably keep me up all night. No, no, it should put you to sleep straight away. Oh yeah, right. You got two dollars? No. You walk? What? You're walking too fast. I can't keep up with I'm you. I'm not trying to walk at your speed. I'm, I am I want to go to bed. Mm-hmm. This is all it takes, and then you go to sleep. <laughs> no, I tell you what, uh, two dollars and I uh, three moonshine. Hey, lady, want some moonshine? <laughs> oh, you. <laughs> Can't around all this money. I need to go to the bank. <laughs> He's talking to the locals. <laughs> He's gonna be behind me when I get out of this. Shelby, what are you doing? <laughs> you made me go to bed. Oh, is he stressed? You're eating pizza? Wish I had pizza. You know what to fix that? What? Moonshine. I seriously doubt that. Oh. Wait, is it going off? <laughs> hey, Callum. How is he not? Ah, uh, yeah. What? What was that? What? What'd you just, what'd you just do? Nothing. Are you just drinking moonshine on the street? 
Well, it's not legal, is it? I don't know anymore. You got a sheriff, are you? Not currently. Well, then you're fine to drink moonshine. I guess. Maybe you can sell it. It's much better if you sell it. Have you ever have you ever actually sold it to anyone? Yeah, well, I sell it to this local over here. Hey! I know that feeling. Sometimes I, I, yeah, I won't have dinner until like between 11 and 12, and I'm like, ha, I'm in danger. <laughs> uh ohs. There's ain't nothing normal about what you're doing. Man, I'm taking a fucking knee. Mind your own fucking business. I will destroy you. You. S <laughs> no problem. Well, see, so you just you sold some then in there, did you? Yeah, it's good money, I tell you. It's pretty popular. Well, I mean, to these guys anyway. <laughs> Aren't you selling it for like four for two dollars? Maybe. That's fifty cents. Fifty cents a bottle. Yeah, but I make them in the hundreds. Yeah, but how how much does it take to make? Or how much do you make in one batch? Well, 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 a lot. He's, you're definitely making a profit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> lots, of, lots of profit. Especially when I'm the only one making them. And how long does it take you to make a batch? Well, I, I don't know. It depends if it blows up or not. Bl blows up? Yeah, you, you gotta cook it just right. Where you do you do this? Just right. uh, where? I make it. Yeah, where do, you, where do you make it? My hands. Pardon? With my hands. Oh, with, with, yeah, but where? Ah, all over the place. Um, <laughs> uh, the bayou, uh, uh, the black waters, uh, wherever where like. All right. Uh, yeah, okay. The problem is, uh, there's big uh, plumes of smoke every time I make it. <laughs> uh, uh, almost anyone in the country can see me. It's crazy. And do they, when they come to check that you're okay, do they buy some then and there? What? No, usually the people that uh, that want to arrest you <laughs> come and see you. There's a the big plume of smoke. You think it's like a fire or something. Well, maybe you shouldn't blow things up. Uh, yeah, that's true. I probably shouldn't blow things up. But sometimes it's very hard to get the, uh, <laughs> the, the finer ingredients together. Well, that's probably because you're doing it by yourself. Maybe you should hire yeah. someone to help you. Yeah, I think you might be on something there. I need to spread the wealth, I guess, and not keep it all to myself. Are you After making all, enough? I did buy this one shoe. Well, have you got enough to buy a second shoe? Uh, not yet, but I'm, I'm saving up for one. How much is the second shoe going to be? Uh, it costs you about $3. Right, okay. H how much moonshine for $3? Uh, I, I can give you a couple. Uh, uh, four, couple right? Dollars. Yeah, yeah, okay, four. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, there's three dollars. Yes, you lucky. You very lucky. That was my last four. Okay, good. See now, now you can go buy a second shoe. All right. Yeah, now, yes. Thank you very much. I will definitely go and look for another shoe. I, I look, would, uh, buy one. The store, the store. There's one here in Blackboard. You can buy a shoe. Oh, but there's so much more I can do with four dollars. What? Oh, wait, three dollars. Oh shit. There's so much more I can do with three dollars. I could get some more copper pipes. No, you you said you needed three dollars for a shoe. No, I just said it cost you about three dollars for a shoe. So you're gonna buy pots and pans instead. That's right. Instead of buying, instead of buying a second shoe. Y yeah. All right. Well. Your well, money. Well, thanks for the uh, the money. Uh, you you had a good evening. 
Yeah. So, I hope you have a nice rest. I will. I hope you have a good day. Yeah, now the, the, the moonshine is quite pungent, so uh, you probably won't be able to drink it. Uh, but if you like, you can just go and sell it to other people. What do you mean I can't drink it? Uh, nothing much. Okay, bye. What? What? <laughs> Can't even drink it. <laughs> Where the fuck did he go? Where the fuck did he go? <laughs> Motherfucker. Swindled. What a bastard. <laughs> he can't even drink it. There's that, there's that prize winning horse that I could have won if I didn't fuck up handing the reins over in that buggy race. Still can't believe that. That was just, I clicked the wrong thing. Oh, this is different. Mister. Get out of here. Fuck. <coughs> you can't. Oh. Uh huh. Oh. I still need to get George Hughes' stress levels right. The madhouse is the next town over. Mate, I'm resting. Get off my back. Is there like a, a room you can stay in here? Oh, hello. Does um, sitting in chairs and that now work to get your, your stress and that sorted? Uh-oh. Boop. 
Biz 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 biz. Is it actually like a snoring sound? Oh, there was! <laughs> Yo, Big C! Stay out of my camp! <laughs> that court, that was so like, oh my god, what the fuck is this? That was so fucking funny. Because they need to make it that like lying in a bed or sitting in a chair gets your... your stress sorted, like taking a knee. Clyde Little. That... I think I remember the Little Brothers? That rings a bell? I think that rings a bell. I think. I think, I think. Tommy Kenway. It takes... Uh, there's been so many characters since August last year. It can be, re it can be really hard to, um, to keep up. Alright. But yeah, I need to... I need to get to bed. Oh! <sighs>